Hey everyone, it's me, Damon, with Creative with Creative Crochet, aka Triple C. This is my husband, Joe. You gonna say hello? Joey. Yes, guys. Thank you for hitting the thumbs up. Please come in, hit the thumbs up, and the subscribe button. For those who are new, thank you so much for joining our channel. So it be super, on, super happy, guys. It should show up on super, YouTube now. super happy. You go okay. to YouTube. Okay, here we go. But yes, guys, thank y'all for coming in. Thank y'all so much for being here. I truly appreciate you guys for being here. Um, like I said, for those who are new, thank you for being here. Thank you for joining. I truly appreciate you all. Let me get into my live chat. Okay, I'm in the live chat. Everybody's here. Hello, Jax. Welcome in. Hello, Jennifer. Hello, Christy. Hello. How are y'all doing? How was your weekend? Hello, welcome in. Welcome, welcome in. Atlanta's here. Welcome in. Thank y'all so much. I just had a great time over at Atlanta's. Just frog it, guys. Awesome time. Thank y'all for coming in. Hello, hello. Everybody's here. DJ's in the building. Yes, yes, yes. We got a just frog it, Ray. You say, hey, how are you? How did your ponchos? How do you get your ponchos? Look? I don't know. I guess it's just the fact that. Thank you for the love. Thank y'all for hitting the thumbs up. See, they're steady going up. I think I just, I'm used to making them so much. I think I've kind of got addicted to making them so much. Okay, you need more, more, more. Uh... Yeah. Let me see more. There we go. You got it? Okay. Let me slide over a bit, guys. I think it's the fact that I make these so much um, that I get kind of used to making them. Oh, my goodness. Everybody's here. Hey, Manda. Hello. Hey, Manda. How are you? Did I say hello to Heather? Hi, hello, everybody. Yeah, you said, of course. Love your ponchos always. Thank you so much. Rosemary's here. Hello. Rosemary said, hey, babe. Hey, Rosemary. How are you? Thank you, Heather. Thank you. Hey, Denny. Welcome in. Thank y'all for hitting a thumbs up as you guys come in. I appreciate you all. Happy Monday, y'all. Uh, how was y'all weekend? I hope you all had a great weekend. We definitely did. Um, we kind of got some. We got some stuff done. I think. Yeah. Did we get some stuff done? Yeah, we got some stuff. Done. We got some stuff done, guys. Did y'all get anything done? I mean, how was your weekend? You said Monday, girl, you got a curfew. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm starting on one for my granddaughter. Wow, that is amazing. Yeah, she's gonna love it. What color are you going with, DJ, for your poncho? Also, Denny, how's your poncho coming? Did you finish up? Well, I know you said you were making two of them. How do you get both of them done? <laughs> he said, Denny, don't tell it. Oh, my goodness. Yes, don't tell our stuff. Don't tell all our business. <laughs> so, yes, guys, let me go ahead and lower this a tad bit. I'm going to be making up some scrubbies. I'm trying to figure out some stuff to make, guys. I'm going to share with you a couple things. We went up. We went and picked up over the weekend. So, I can see exactly what. I just got a couple things, and I want to. Make something tonight with them. Oh my goodness, Laura's here in the building. Hey, Laura, welcome in. Laura said, hey, babe. Hey, Laura, how are you? He said, I'm fine, getting ready for the morning. Oh, okay, so what you got going on? You got some appointments or something in in the morning, Manda? He said, pick blackberries and make 10 jars of jam today. Oh, that's amazing. Everybody said, great weekend. That's great prayers for tomorrow, Manda. Yes, definitely prayers, Manda. And definitely will be praying for you tonight, Manda. And so... um. Oh, for surgery, I guess. Yes, praying, 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 praying. Okay. So, how's everybody feeling pretty good? How's everybody's day been going? Okay. Yes. Okay. Let me see. Sandra's here. Hello, Sandra. Welcome in. How you doing? Are you new here, Sandra? Um, I appreciate you for being here. Thank you so much for hitting that thumbs up. He said, Joe, you do down with that chicken old school. That's why. That's how I learned, and I'm old enough to be your mom. All right. So, I'm talking about Rosemary. Thank, Thank you, you for the love. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You said, I'm going to work on my poncho with you. Yes, okay. Yes, work on your poncho. You said, hey, Triple C. Hey, CJ Spicy, how you doing? CJ Spicy. Yes. It's in the building. <laughs> woo, 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 CJ Spicy. And you said, Joe was about to look at cooking with Joe Fried. Oh, you said, yeah, look at that video. You will love it. Yes, CJ, you're going to love that video. A lot of people got it good? Yeah, I'm good. Okay, so a lot of people love that video, y'all. And Joe is going to be, we're going to be coming up with more videos. Um, we're trying to get this video up to 500 views. When it gets up to 500 views, guys, we'll go ahead and drop another cooking video, guys. And um, I'm going to read all these comments, and then we're going to ask a question. Um, we're going to need your guys' opinion. What do you guys think? Okay, so hey. Hey, guys, I'm, I'm out of the camera view tonight like a bald-headed stepchild. You see how she treat me? Well, I, was just I got to look in. No, I was just letting them get comfortable, guys. I was letting them get comfortable, don't. <laughs> oh my god, help me. I just want to let them get settled. 
Thank y'all for hitting the thumbs up. Thank y'all so much. Yes. Shelly's in the building. Hey, Shelly. Yes, yes, yes. Diva J is saying it's white, peach, purple, gold, and tan. So I'm excited. Fried chicken soon. Oh, my goodness, Shelly. I can't wait. Tell us how it comes out. Yeah, I said, be right back. I have to go outhouse. All right. Mimi's in the building. Hello, Dana. Got the red and white, blue one done. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Yes, yes. Everybody show some love. Hello, Lisey. Welcome in. Hello, how are you doing? I hope it's Lisey or Lisey. Maybe Lisey. Uh, thank you for being here. Hello, welcome in. Hi, Hit the up. Everybody's here. You said, Danny, you're here. Before. Thank you so much, Denny. This is very new. I'm just trying something new out. I wasn't sure it was going to come out pretty good, but I'm glad it did. Joe was like, yes, love it. So <laughs> thank y'all so much. Hello, Froggy Winter Knitting. Welcome in. We got some new people up in here. I'm so happy. Thank y'all for hitting a thumbs up. Guys, we're going to have a great night. I'm so happy. I just want to tell everybody hello. Get all my love up in here, and then we're going to get started. Okay, so Sis Carla's in the building. Hello. He said, enjoy the chicken video. Make me hungry. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Yes, you sidekick Joe. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. You can tell. See, I'm still looking at the screen. No, Chrissy said Joe wants to steal the show. I know. I'm still looking at the screen. Look at me. He said, not bald headed stepchild. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Redhead stepchild. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he said, Joe, yep, we see how she treats you. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Y'all are hilarious. Oh, my goodness. Yes, Les, you got it right. All right. Thank you so much. So glad that you're here, Lisey. Welcome in. I'm Dana. This is my husband, Joe. And we like to do a little bit of crocheting and some crafting. A little chatting. You may get some gospel music here and there. I'm going to Mimi's channel. Mimi, can I be on your channel? So do you want to start it off, honey? What, what you got going down. on? For well, me, well, let me do a little intro for, before you get started. Yeah, so sure. For the new people. All right. For all of our new people, hello. Welcome in. We love you guys. Uh, this parn parn show. This parn show <laughs> is made with Karen Simply Soft in one of the purples. I'm not exactly sure. But I use the um, Yarn Bee Metallic sequin thread from a hobby lobby to add to it and it's kind of like halfway through because the bottom has none i didn't really want to waste another um spool of it you said joe you always could have you remind me of my husband oh my goodness rosemary this guy right here he said joe did you bring me any chicken oh maxine said did you bring her any chicken mm -hmm. maxine you gonna let me join your channel i'll be good i'll be getting treated bad over here yeah maxine makes some really good stuff guys really does you said yes denny okay all right, let me see. Did I miss anybody? Did I miss anybody? Okay. No, I didn't miss anybody. Okay. <laughs> yes, it's a parn show. Exactly. Yes, sweetie, you can, but bring Dana to... Oh, okay, that's what I'm talking about. Because, Denny, I'm going to I'm bed after my daughter here, finish her toes. Me. Oh, my goodness. So you can get toes and stuff painted all up? Okay, that's good, Manda. Yes, we're definitely going to be praying for you, Manda. I'm just, I love you so much. Um, you got this. Everything's going to be great. You got this, okay? Um, I can't wait to hear more. Um... You know, I can't wait to hear your testimony afterwards. The big part right there, Papi, you know? I know, but it's too far down there. Aw. Look at you making a whole stand that's like my that. That's my daughter. Ooh, stick some toilet paper in there, babe. That's my daughter did that. Jason, give me some of those napkins. I don't, those napkins. I don't worry about it, but it ain't that big of a deal. I don't need it like that anyway. Okay. I just use it for my smaller hooks. But you can also put, the, put that in there, though. Okay, guys. So, for those who have been watching, those who have been watching, you said Joe's your husband's name, too? All right. So, Froggy went, went on knitting. I'm Dana. I don't know what your name is, if you care to tell us a little bit. But like I said, this is Joe. I'm uh, Joe. I can introduce myself. Dang, I can't even talk no more. Guys, please hit Froggy, the thumbs up. Froggy wanna knitting. I'm Joe. Me. Me, Joe. Okay, yeah, he's a little nuts. So don't let him run you off, guys. He's a little crazy, but he will make you laugh. But if you guys can hit the thumbs up, I truly appreciate it. It's super Appreciate it, guys. He said, Joe, how is your daughter's date going? And are you feeling calm? Oh, yes. Well, the date was only a couple hours, you know. Um, I love the fact that um, our daughter's boyfriend, his parents are very respectful. So they are really protective over him. We're really protective over her. So they're just like, okay, yeah, you can go out for a couple hours, get home. <laughs> and I love that because it's always a respectable hour. You know, they went out from like 5.30 to like 8, you know. So I'm like, okay, cool. So they had a great time. They ended up going to um, a re Italian restaurant, right? Yeah. They did. They did. And joke, we got pictures. Um, I probably will post them tomorrow in the um, communication, communication, what's it called? The community tab. I'll post those in the community tab, guys, so you can see that. Our baby girl's going to be 18 this year, guys. So she had her first date, had a ball. He greeted her with roses, guys. Yes, a dozen roses greeted her with those, and it was really nice. Um, really, really sweet. Very respectable young man. And I was always praying that, y'all. When you got kids, you got especially your daughters. I'm not saying not your sons, because you gotta have good your sons need to have good wives as well. 
Um, but you know, in this day and age, there's so much stuff going on with these husbands versus the wives. And I just, we've been always praying that our daughter gets somebody that's really respectful. Um, you know, doesn't have really bad, horrible anger issues, has a good relationship with her mom and parents, you know, very respectful and understanding, hard worker. So the fact that this, you know, she was able to be blessed with somebody good like that, I was like, yes, which we are not marrying her off yet, but just to even have that, you know, just to keep company with somebody who is on a respectful level. That's what I'm saying, you know? Okay, you said this. Thank you for the prayers. Okay, hello, hello, hello. Thank you for the prayers. Hello, one virtuous woman. Welcome in. How are you doing? Sharon's in the building. Hello, Sharon. Okay, yes. Okay. All righty. So you're Jennifer. Okay, so we got another Jennifer here. Okay, I'm, I'll be getting some Jennifers up in here. Loving it. How you doing, OBW? How you feeling? You feeling any better? Been definitely praying for you. Keep you lifted up. I know those headaches, migraines, any type of head pressures, facial uh, pain from any type. I don't know if you have a facial or where your headache is at. But yes, definitely been praying for you. I hope you're feeling better because I know about those headaches that you have to sleep on and for them to go away because staying up can definitely make it worse. Okay, you said 25 subscribers, only, only five up. I know. Can we get some more thumbs up? Thank you, Rosemary. Thank you for letting everybody know. Give me some thumbs up, y'all. <laughs> Nani May's in the building. Hello, hello. Yes, Pam's in the building. Hello, Pam. You said, hey, Joe, that chicken look yummy. Thank you, thank you, thank oh, you. Oh, my goodness. Appreciate you so much. You said, yes, don't you know, man. You said, don't know you, Mina, but we'll definitely say a prayer for Oh, that's so sweet, Lisey. I guess, I guess the most important question is, does he love? And he loves Jesus. He loves you, his mom and dad. I mean, it's very yeah. sweet. Well, his mom and dad are older than us, you know? Um, and they're just so sweet and respectful. And, I mean, I just love that, you know? Because I feel like a lot of people that are our age are, are just a little bit... I feel like they're... Crazy. Yeah, and so the fact that his parents are older than no, us... I'm just kidding. No, but I'm we, we mesh that. well. His parents and our, us, we mesh well. We talk. I mean, we have a great relationship. I just love it. It's just, it's just all that, you know? I'm just... It's everything that, you know... All, all the up and ups. Okay, guys. So everybody knows Joe's been hooking on these. Hook, he's been working on these hooks, guys. For those who know, he has been making handles for ergonomic hooks, or making uh, handles on regular hooks that are not ergonomic, and he's been turning them into ergonomic hooks. So he's on a roll, y'all. He is going nuts. Thanks to Denny. Thanks to Noni May. Both of them are the hook queens, and so they were giving Joe all these ideas, like, "Hey, you should make hooks." Joe's addicted to clay. He used to make all kinds of big pottery when he was younger. He used to surprise me with different pottery pieces. And I would never think he would make them. I thought he was like, buy them somewhere and say he made them. Because I'm like, okay, never met a guy who does pottery. Not saying he can't do it, but I'm just like, okay. Anyways, this man is going nuts on the hooks. Y'all can't wait to show y'all what he's got going on. You say, yes, Joe, look at your face. There's a lot of what you got to say. Yeah, this guy right here, his face. Mondo, you make sure you message us and let us know what's going on. Or somebody... Yes, Joe, I love Joe's expressions. Yes. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yes, we're going to keep her lifted up. We're going to keep everybody lifted up. Thank you so much. Laura says she's back. Okay, Laura, I'm so glad y'all back. I want y'all to see what Joe has been working on over this weekend, y'all, because he's addicted. For those who were in Lana's, Lana's Live yesterday, was it yesterday? Yes. I believe it was yesterday. Shout out to Lana and Jess Frog, and she taught me how to do some awesome uh, Tunisian crochet stitches, guys. I learned some. My favorite now is Honeycomb. I learned how to do the pearl, and I learned how to do the honeycomb, and I'm in love, guys. So y'all going to see some new stuff come with that. But uh, Joe is hooked on these hooks, so he's going to share with you guys what he has going on. I'm going to be Ooh, tilting. Denisha will let everyone know. Okay. Okay, thank cool. you. Cool, thank you so much, Manda. I truly appreciate that. I'm so ready. I mean, I, I'm going to keep you lifted up and pray that. I know Denny going to let us know. Yes. Big as her mouth is. Wow, what, what is going on? What's Hello, Denise is in the building. Hello, how you doing, Denise? Hi, Denny. Denny says something. Um, how you gonna do her like that? Don't do my girl Denny like that. Denny, what you say? You say Can you show us your oh. hooks? So he's gonna show us what he's got going on, guys. He has been just killing the game on the hooks, guys. All right, killing the game on the hooks. All right, here's one of my first new ones. Look, this is one of the newbies, guys. All right, you got it. You gonna turn it, do a swirl okay. or a little rotate? Okay. Yeah, somebody wants to slip out of my hand. You want to? You want to hold yeah, it? Yeah, you go Okay, ahead. I'll, you I'll go. do a little hold. I'll do. The, I'll be the Vanna White and the assistant on tonight. Look at that, guys. He's added some glitter. He's turned to a glitter guy now, and we got some pinks. We got some purple, some yellow, or is it blue? I'm thinking it looks. It looks like a little blue. I'm gonna say blue, pink, purple, pink, blue, and yellow. I'm loving this one, guys. This one is really cute. It's a size eight shook, guys. So 
Many people like size H hooks, so that's one. That's there. You want to show any more? Yeah, give me a second. You want to show some old ones? Okay, show this one. Okay, I'm going to show you the new ones, and then I'll show you guys some old ones as well. Everybody showing some love. Yes, yes, yes. Um, Jennifer says she loves it. Mimi says loves it. Thank Noni you. May says beautiful, Joe. Sis Carla says nice. Joe, you wait until we get another live where you are not a moderator. I'm going to zap him. Who's that? Danny, when you go to another somebody else's live, he's like, you have been hidden. You have been timed out. <laughs> Danny, I love you. You know I love you. Come on, Danny. Oh, my goodness. Oh, now Shelly is also throwing out another um, idea. She says red, white, and blue with a star glitter. Now, that sounds amazing, Shelly. Because Shelly inspired Joe for another hook, and it really came out great. Okay, so here goes another one, guys. This kind of gives me Christmas vibes, holiday time That's vibes, y'all. Because somebody wanted Christmas. Someone mentioned Christmas, guys. So there we go. Holiday sparkle. Could that be called holiday sparkle? Yes. This is a size K hook, guys, all right? For those who like the K hooks, um, this is what I usually do these ponchos in, guys. So this is, makes it perfect. If you want to make a poncho, you're like, hmm, perfect. You got another one to show us? Yes, sir. Guys, it's the, it gets better and better, guys. You said only 17 thumbs up? Thank you so much. Rosemary's on it. She said, I need seven. I need nine more thumbs up. Thank you so much, Rosemary. Don't, Rosemary's and Can y'all come on? Hit that thumbs up, guys. Thank you so much for being on it. I appreciate you guys. Y'all are amazing. Guys, Jefferson, I love Christmas. Me too. Uh, okay, so yeah, you met. we met through. I got to make sure I'm subscribed to you as well, Jennifer. You do have a channel, right? Since your name is Froggy Went and Knitting. I want to make sure I'm subscribed to you. I'm a big supporter. So I know you don't know that yet because you're new here. I'm a big supporter. I let people drop their links so we can all become family. Um, all that good stuff. I'm all about that. I'm all about coming to your videos and actually stalking you. Because once I get, you know, become a part of your family, I like to stalk you. Hit the thumbs up multiple times. Leave lots of comments. Maybe even email you. But I'm addicted to that because I love everybody. Stalk. Okay, so here's another one, guys. I don't even know if this one can be called, but this could be like a little... I don't even know. What Give is me this a name for it, guys. What is kind of name? Look at this guy. It kind of gives me some little mocha vibes. But what was this? This has got some green in there. Oh, it's like a little army. Because I see the green. I didn't see that at first. There's like a tan, a brown, and then there's a like a little army green in there. I didn't see it. Okay, so this is another one. Sorry, something went wrong. Okay, yeah, I didn't call you, huh? Let me turn you off because you're going to think I call you everything I say. <laughs> okay, so this is a size D hook, guys. This is a size D. Oh, my goodness. My girl Shanna's in the building. Hey, Shanna, how are you doing? I can't wait to do a collab with you where you can come on and we can do the graphs. That will be happening soon. Just been kind of got to figure out a good day. Definitely would love that. You know, I just got to figure out when your schedule is, how you want to do it. But I think like you've been wanting, you know, kind of show everybody how to work on some graphs. A lot of people have been wanting to do it. Um, so I definitely appreciate you so much if you want to do that. Thank you for coming in. Thank you for the thumbs up. Yes. Oh, my goodness. Hello. You said Lease, Lease Creates. Welcome in. How are you doing? Thank you for being here. So good evening. New here. Love the crochet hooks. I turned on. All, I turned all of my hooks into these fancy clips. Wow, did you? How amazing. Thank you for being here. Thank you for the thumbs up. I'm Dan. This is my husband, Joe. He's the hooker here Well, when it comes to making I'm a hooks. hooker. He, he actually can crochet, I'm a guys. He actually can crochet as well. I taught him how to crochet. I'm a hooker. I just don't stay on the corner. Um, But, yes, thank you for coming in. Thank you for being new to the channel. If you do come in and you show some love, guys, you'll be seeing this guy say some crazy things. And the faces are even crazier. But don't worry, guys. He will not bite. He's just a friendly old guy. Very sweet. Oh, and... on Tuesdays. <laughs> oh, I forgot. He bites on Tuesdays, so. Just get back on Tuesdays, guys. So that's tomorrow. <laughs> you want to make some hooks? Okay, that would be great. Yeah, it's so fun. Joe needs to respect his elders. He said, I'm doing a giveaway. All right, so Jennifer's doing a giveaway, guys. So if you do want to be a part of Jennifer's giveaway, guys, you got to be a subscriber over here, okay? You got to go over to Froggy Went a Knitting, guys. I don't know if anybody wants to drop her link, guys. Go over to her link, become family with her, and you'll go be able to her be link. Part. Well, hit her link. I'm trying to be relaxed because sometimes he gets me a little riled up. I'm just trying to keep calm. I need to drink my coffee. Can I have some? Let me see what everybody's saying. You said the camel look. Yes. The camel hook. Yes. Mocha chocolata. Mocha chocolate. Yes. I was thinking the same thing because those browns and stuff. And I love chocolate. Chocolate camel. Ooh. 
Y'all got some good ideas. Love it. Get your thumbs up. Thank you so much. Thank you, all camouflage. Hi, thank you for saying my name right. Oh my goodness, I'm so glad I did. Cause I try to say names right, and I'm really good at remembering them, but I try to get them right. Chelsea loves in the building. Hello, hello. Chelsea loves says, "Don't worry, y'all. I'm a hooker too." <laughs> Everybody's showing some love to her. I'm cracking up as usual. Usual. <laughs> Kathy's in the building. Hello, Kathy Pearson. Welcome in. I'm Dana. This is my husband, Joe. Appreciate you for being here. Thank you so much for hitting the thumbs up. You are going to be enjoying this beautiful night. We're showing some hooks, guys. I appreciate you all for being here. Got some new people here. I'm loving it, y'all. So I'm a hooker too, Joe, and I love being, and I've been known to stand on the corner with a sign that is proof. You know what? Laura, I can't even breathe right now. Did you hear what Laura's? Mm-hmm. Joe, can you sing like an angel? Joe can sing like, oh, thank you so much, Lana. Lana saying, um, Joe can sing like an angel. Thank you so much for that. Thank and you, Lana. I appreciate that. Station Diva is showing some love to Froggy. I don't know if I have any moderators who can throw um Well, Froggy, I'll make you a moderator. You can just drop your own link. Don't worry, Jennifer. Do you want to drop your own link? You're more than welcome. Make sure you're on top chat, Daryl. Okay. I mean, um, Make sure I'm on live chat. Okay. We got, I got so, so many froggy. I never knew there's so many people. I'm going to be honest. So many people that. Froggy, froggy. Was a froggy. Yeah. Had a froggy. Went to the froggy. Pink Motivations in the building. Hello. Welcome in. How are you doing? I am believe this might be your first time being here. I know I've seen you on different channels and things like that. Welcome in. I'm Dana. This is my husband, Joe. I appreciate you for being here. Thank you so much, y'all. Thank y'all so much. I'm just trying to get everybody in here. And I want to make sure if anybody wants to drop your link, you are more than welcome to. So welcome. You're from Texas. All right. I'm from Indiana. Good old Indiana. About five minutes away from Notre Dame Studios. Notre Dame Studios. Notre Dame campus. She she come from Notre Dame Studios, wherever that's at. Okay. All righty. So Denny has a link up. Thank you so much, Denny. This is Froggy Winter Knitting. Make sure we're connected with Froggy Winter Knitting, please. I want to make sure we are all family. I feel like I, did I just see Froggy Winter Knitting earlier? Froggy Did you have a video earlier? This is the same video from earlier? Or did you go live or anything? Is it live? Because I feel like I saw her in the notifications, but I was doing hair and I couldn't go in. Shonda's in the building. Thank you, Shonda, for being here. How you feeling tonight? I appreciate you for being here. You always come up and support. You are so sweet. We're still 10 behind. Oh, my goodness. Come on. Hit the thumbs up, guys. We're almost there, y'all. Come on. Come on. Hit the thumbs up. Thank y'all so much for being here. I truly appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Okay, let's see. Okay, you said Dana want me to drop people's links. Oh, if you want to, if anybody wants their links dropped, that'd be awesome. I would truly. Okay, you did put one of link. Okay, yeah, guys, I saw your video earlier, but I was doing my niece's hair, y'all. Now check this one out. Look at that. Check this one out, y'all. Now this one is super. Look at the stars, y'all. He got the stars going on. He got some more glitter, and I'm seeing some green, some yellow, and orange. Look at that. What do y'all think about this one? I'm loving this one. I'm loving it. Thank you so much. So much. I appreciate you, Noni Mae. If anybody wants their link drop, um, you know, you can get with Noni Mae. Noni Mae will hold you down and make sure you're good. Now, well, she won't hold you down, but she will help you out. Okay, so what are you making tonight? Okay, so what I'm going to be making, Joe's going to be making some more hooks, but I'm going to be making up some scrubbies, and I got my tablet. Um, I'm going to be finding something really nice to make, because i got to show you guys some new yarn that I have. Maybe you might give me some ideas. Yes, you are. Oh, let me get you on here. Shanna, where are you at? You definitely can drop your link. Um, where um, Noni May, Noni May will be dropping links as well. Okay, so I'm already got her and didn't know it. Really? Yeah. I mean, sometimes we have each other and we don't even know. Okay, you said Denny said that's my hook. So that hook. What size is that star hook? That is an F. That's an F size. You got another one for me? Yes. Okay, so we're gonna still keep this ball rolling and show you some more. We got a little bit of show and tell, guys. Okay, yes, you love the blue and green. Yes, everybody shows some love. Everybody says pretty, loving it. Beautiful. Thank y'all for the love, y'all. Thank you, thank you. Love y'all, and I'll be back with y'all soon. Okay, all right, Mina, we love you. Sleep tight. We got you. We're going to keep you lifted up in prayer. You got this. We love you. Okay, so I'm going to, you said my head's feeling better? Okay, so glad to hear that, Heather. I'm so, so glad. Oh, my goodness. You said, no, we're going to fight then. Oh, my goodness. Denise wants that one, too. Okay, here goes another one. What color is this? It's like blue. 
What is this, babe? Like a yellow, blue, or, yellow bone orange? Yes. Okay, so this is like a yellow this bone orange. This was inspired by my daughter. My daughter asked me to do that. So this is a yellow, blue, and orange, guys. And we have triangles here. Okay. So then we got the glitter as well. This is a size 8 shook. Um, what size was that other one? The last one I just did, that one. Was that F? It's an F, yeah. This is an F hook right here. Yeah. And guys, this is my favorite. Yeah, this is my favorite too. You guys, I think you're going to love this one too, guys. I'm going to be honest. You missed the green. Oh, you missed the green one? What's the green one? Okay, you missed the green one. This is the green one right here. It has the stars on it. Okay. We got that one. And what's everybody saying, guys? Okay, so Nona May is going to be dropping some links. She got pink motivation here. Okay, and look at this one, y'all. This kind of gives me like, there's what is this, hearts on here? Okay, there's hearts. I wish I could do it. Okay, a little bit glare because my lighting is kind of weird, but I'm trying not to be so glarish. But there's pinks, there's baby blue and white, and there's hearts on there. And it kind of gives me a little unicorn feel. I don't know why, guys. I thought it was going to be like, kind of remind me of a baby, you know, but it reminds me of like a unicorn. I love it. And the shapes on here are really nice because they help you kind of grip it. Gives you a really nice grip to them. Because I was wondering how these shapes would feel, and they feel really, really nice, y'all. I'm going to be really honest. I love them. So don't make me get my whooping stick. Oh, my gosh. Oh, he said the last one was smooth, right? The last one was smooth, right? Um, it had, heart, it had, uh, it had stars on there. Yeah, this one has stars. There's a different ones. He has smooth ones, and he has ones with shapes on them. And he has ones with glitter on them and ones without the glaze. Like this one. Okay, this is the um the rainbow one, kinda like autism speaks one. It's something that I'm going back and I'm putting a fresh coat of glaze on. Yes, this is a two millimeter. Okay. This is everyone a lot of people's favorite. Are you are these okay? Are yeah, touch? Okay. Fine. Um no, this I'm, is a lot of people love this one right here. This one is a size Three millimeter, guys. This is three millimeter. Yep, three millimeter. Got your purple, your teals, white, and this is just, like I said. There's no glitter here, and it's just a nice glaze on it. A lot of people love that one. Three millimeter. This is a teal, a teal tan, and a blue. So we got. He's been going on, guys. Y'all. I mean, y'all. This Look man's been addicted. He is addicted, y'all. Look the Um, show more. Okay, yeah, so where's my orange, orange one? one. For the okay. people who ain't. Uh... Here's your orange one. Mimi's orange one's here, y'all. Mimi's like, where's my orange one? This was inspired by the beautiful Shelly T. Here's the orange one. This is a I, which is a 5.5. .5. Help me, Joe. Oh my goodness, good. Could I get one that looks like one with stars, but only smooth? Okay, you said, could I get one that looks like the one with... Oh, okay, so you want one with the stars. Where's the one with the stars at? Right here. Okay, so you want one with these colors, okay? You want one with these colors, but you well, just want you with no, want stars. no stars. No stars on it. Do you want glitter or no glitter? Okay, so I got to make sure I write these down. Elijah, I need you to write these down for me. Okay. Okay, love, love, love. Everybody show some love. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, yeah, yeah, early. So I would like a purple oh, one with glitter, please. Thank you. Okay. And does anybody want, okay, so Heather, Shanna, what size hooks would y'all like? Okay, then I hold on the left, hold them on the left. I'll oh, hold it on here. Hey, Barbara, I'm sorry to see you come in. Hello, welcome in. Okay, you said that's mine. Okay, Mimi said that's mine right there. Looks like a phoenix. Yes, I love it. Okay, you said if you guys would like to order hooks from Joe, need to email him and Dana. Yes, that will send you an invoice. Yes. That is so smart. Thank you so much. Yes, we got email and that? PayPal. That's, that? that's our secretary, Denny, guys. Denny, yep. Give me that uh, we got going the coffee. Okay, because Denny's our secretary, guys. She will definitely be keeping up with everybody who's saying orders or different things and letting you not guys know. That's the best way to really reach us through the email. It's in the About tab. It's MC. I don't know if you guys want to type that up. So. You can type it up if you want to. I can't type it up. I can't. I can oh, yeah, you can that. type it up. Okay, Joel put the email in the, um, in the comments. What is it? Which one is it? Um, Emma Cloud, you're already. Uh. I've got to figure out how much they are. We're going to be doing... Uh, different prices uh, depending on colors, glitters, uh, and shapes added, right? Yes. Okay, so we're going to give you guys, we're going to get a uh, set price so everybody can know, um, you know. What do you 
you Okay, all righty. You know, Jax. Okay, Shannon wants a J6. Okay, you can still write it down, though. Yeah. So we can still have it ready for hey, Purple Shannon. Glitter J, J6. Heather's thinking about a G. He said, I can't stay too long. Okay, no problem, Denise. I know. Oh, you got to go to the hospital tomorrow? Really? Wow, okay, okay. Well, we'll definitely be praying for you. You got, a, you got appointments or visiting someone? Or he said, that one is fire. That one's fire. Oh, my goodness. Yes. Okay, guys. So Joe's going to be doing that. He's got the link up. And I'm going to be going to do some creating, guys. I'm going to do some hooks. I'm going to do some scrubbies as well because I always have to do these hooks. I always have to do these um, scrubbies. Do you guys make scrubbies at home in the kitchen oh, where you yeah. like um? Sorry. I'm sorry. What are you going? All my yeah. hooks. I'm gonna show some more. Hooks. Okay, you want to show some more hooks? Okay, Joe's gonna be showing some more hooks, guys. So they are going to check to see if I have lung. Oh my! Oh, you did sell us that, didn't you, Denise? Yes, and we were been praying you up for that. I'm sorry. I didn't know which day, uh, you had to go in. So it's tomorrow. Okay. Yeah, because you did tell me the date. You told me the date. You said it was the 16th. So guys, that's tomorrow. Thank you so much, Barbara, for the love you Dana and Joe. You should take them to the craft show. Yes, we're definitely going to be taking them to the craft show. Most definitely. Most definitely. That's going to be on August 15th, so we're going to be getting some. Joe's going to have to order some more hooks. That's another one, yeah, guys. You think of that for one. anyone who didn't get to see this one. You said make a scrubby. Make, I, I make scrubbies. Do you make scrubbies? Yes, I love these. And this is um the scrubby cotton. I've never used a scrubby cotton from Red Heart, but I've used a regular scrubby. Um, have you ever used a regular scrubby cotton? I don't really know what the difference is, honestly. I'm going to try it out and see, because I really don't know. Where's my green? Can you give me my green pouch right here? You get a chance to give me that green pouch. Oh my goodness, Chris is here. Long time no see, Christy. Well, in this live, I've been seeing you everywhere. I'm so glad you got to come in and pop in. Hello, how are you doing? And then I need your address so I can send you the croquet. Okay, yes, I sent you an email. I don't know if you ever got it. I sent you an email. I hope I got it right. But okay, yes. Um, I definitely will be um sending you I can send you another email or if you want to send me an email just to say hi or something, it's in the um description. Joe posted it a little bit. I'm gonna post it again. That way, um you can let me know. Cause I might have I tried to email you, I might have emailed you the wrong name. Cause that happens sometimes. I might leave out one letter and then it's just not at all. I'm so happy that you're here. Thank you so much. Yes, I love your work. You know I love your work. I've been following your videos and loving them and liking them. Yes, everybody showing some love. Looks like marble. Yeah, it does. Oh, really, Mimi? It's one of your favorite. So you like to use a scrubby yarn? I mean, the cotton one? Okay, you didn't get it yet. I don't know what happened. Yeah, I sent it like probably that same night or maybe the next day. I don't know. Okay, so guys, yes, we're praying. Yes, you did. I don't know. Yeah, like I said, I might have left off a number or a letter or something. I'm, I'm good at doing that. And then people are like, "Oh, you never emailed me." I'm like, I go back and check. Oh yeah, I definitely left out a letter, or I might have added too many extra in. It's like, cat, I need your ruler. I'm about to put it, put my down on Etsy. Usually, twelve year old for sale for a dollar. Oh, okay, yes. Oh, okay, gently used. Oh, okay. He said, when I make my scrubbies, I use one strand scrubby and one cotton together. Ooh, show that's amazing. I like that. Love that idea. Okay, guys, I have a question for you. Okay. What colors? I need colors for hooks. I have two hooks left. I have a K and a J. Throw me some colors out there. What colors should I make? And so, guys, also, oh, my goodness, thanks, family. Y'all have thumbs up. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, you said you got your son on. You put your son on Etsy. He's gently used, 12 years old, for sale for a dollar. Here we go. I, I read that. I understood it. <laughs> wow, Jax, you sound like us. We usually try to sell our children um, for a dollar. Yeah, usually like a buck. Yeah, we try to sell our children for a dollar, two for a dollar, or one penny usually. Yeah. Sometimes we do like maybe three for a penny or one penny each, depending on. So Mimi's already throwing out orange. She's like, orange. Barbara says, blue and blue, white, turquoise. Do we have, we, that, I think that's like a really common color. Blue, whites, and turquoises are really popular. And then we have um, pink, orange, and green. Okay, what else we got? Orange and black. Purple, pink, white glitter, stars. Oh, 
purple, pink, white, glitters, and stars. With a J. Okay, that's what Denise wants. Orange and black, pink, orange, and green. He said, I make. Okay. So pink, orange, and green. Have we ever done anything like that? Pink, pink, orange, and green. No, that's what we're going to do. We're going to do pink, orange, and green. Okay, that does sound a lot different than we never did that one. Yes. Before. So I make all my own dish racks and scrubbers. I never buy so Exactly, I love that. I definitely, I'm so much in agreement with you, Noni May. I love to make my own. Look, Jack says, return to center. <laughs> oh my goodness, yeah, that's the age. That's a little preteen age. Tell me about it, especially with boys. I'm telling you, it's like they drive you nuts. He says, dark blue, baby blue, and pink and white. Wow, that's a lo I dark love that. Blue. So we're going to do those two, guys. We got two. Yep. So we're going to do pink. What was Pink, orange, and green? Yeah, we're doing pink, orange, and green first. Okay. So let's get our Ooh, turquoise and black. He said, Dana, please hit the link that Joe dropped in here with an email. Okay, please. Oh, please hit the link. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Yes, when I make dishcloths, I use scrubby for a third of it, then switches to cotton for the rest. Oh, really? With silver glitter. Okay. You said, I sold hooks today on Etsy, Joe. Get them hooks on Etsy. People go nuts over them. Okay, yes, we definitely will. Pink, orange, and green? Yes, we'll definitely get those on Etsy. I'll probably get some pictures taken later. So, yeah, yeah pink, orange, and green. So we went over to um, Joanne's again because this guy, he needed some glitter and he needed some more clay. Um, and do you want to show what kind of clay you end up getting? Because some people didn't get to see it on Lana's. So we end up grabbing this up, guys. Like, meow. He ended up grabbing one of these up. He still hasn't opened it yet because he still has some, some left over. But he's like, he had to get this guy. So he grabbed that up. And I got to get some yarn, guys. Some more cupcake yarn. Some of you might have seen I make some. I got some cupcake yarn. Joe surprised me with some. So I got this Sea Breeze, y'all. Loving it. Look at that. What do y'all think? I love this because it's 590 yards. It is a size 3, but I love it because... Hey, Lang's in the building. Hello. Hey, how are you? How are you? So how are y'all doing tonight? What are you doing? What are you working on? Joe is making hooks, Elaine. Hello. Welcome in. You love the orange in that box? Oh, my goodness. Yeah, you love the yarn? Thank you so much. I appreciate y'all. So, yeah, I love this. I'm going to be giving away a poncho, guys. For many of you know, I make this poncho all the time. So I'm going to be making up a poncho. I'm going to be giving um, away a poncho. Joe's going to be giving away a hook. I'm going to give away a poncho. And I went and got some more yarn. So you guys can pick what color you want in this giveaway. This is another one. Another cupcake, guys. I got this from Joann's. They were doing a sale on it. Um, 590, like I said, 590 yards, 100% acrylic. Let me see what color this is called. It's called Sandcastle. What do you guys think? I love it. I love it. Really pretty. And then I have another one I'm going to share with you. I got three of them. This one is called Moody Blue. Look at that. You know, I love my blues. And so when it comes with that, it kind of just, you know, got a little green there, a little darker blue. And then it has like the little, what is it, like a little tan. It's kind of like a speckled tan. Because if you look at it, if I pulled back this label a bit, you'll see some little speckles in there. I like that. So, guys, sorry, not to cut you off. Are we putting on this pink, orange, and green hook, are we putting glitter on this hook? Are we putting shapes on this hook? And if so, let me know what shapes and if we're putting glitter on there or not. Because I love the first of the three. You love the first of Sea Breeze? Really? Yeah, so that's what I'm going to be doing, guys. Um, Noni, I sent you a message on Messenger. All right. Okay, so yes. All right. So, um, glitter. Oh, yes, glitter. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so, um, and thank you for those who actually have, um, okay, you so said glitter and use, glitter, use the J. How did you get, you said you got J, six and six millimeter? Yeah, okay. I'm using the J because it's got the green in it, guys. Mm -hmm. So I'm definitely going to use the J. Okay, and you said glitter. How much does glitter cost? How much does glitter cost? You're talking to get on a hook? Um, we got to figure out prices. I got to figure out prices on there. Okay, so I want the pink and orange and green. Okay, you want the pink, orange, and green? Oh, the one that's getting made right now, pink, orange, and green? Okay. You love shiny stuff. Okay. All right, guys. We'll let, we're will let we going to get all the detailed information out, guys. 
And we'll probably have it all by tomorrow. We didn't get that's the homework we could, we should have worked on over this weekend. We didn't get a chance. But we're gonna get all that homework in yeah, for you guys. We shot a bunch of videos, guys. So we yeah, never... we've been doing a lot of videos, guys. So that's what we're kind of getting caught up on. So thank you for those who are already inquiring about them. Like I said, we're gonna have all the information by tomorrow, guys, to make sure that we have really, you know, really good deals and everything for you guys. Thank you so much, Elaine. So I'm gonna figure out what I wanna work on. I'm gonna probably do a couple scrubbies because I actually need some. I need these, I make these all the time. He said, did you all do this? Yes, we did the Tunisian over Atlanta's channel. She had a beautiful live yesterday, guys. It was so fun. I actually got to go on the screen and we worked on some different things. She taught me how to do some stitches. We did, Um, we went over the simple stitch, the knit stitch, what else, the pearl and the honeycomb. And I'm telling you, I fell in love with the honeycomb. Oh, should I, do I have mine with me? Elijah, do you see it in my, um, oh, right there, up back there. See and, right there, right and there. Some, nut even right there, right over, there, some nut even was over there talking about wearing a crochet thong. What a nut. Oh, there's my other one. Do I got another one down here somewhere? Another little swatch. Blue swatch in here. No. Yeah, it's kind of like this. It's like a little patch of work. I don't know if it's on the couch. It might be. But yes, guys, so you said Elaine, yes, Oswald. Yes, how have you been doing, Elaine? How have you been doing? How are the children? Oh, he said Joe can put whatever shapes inspire him. Oh, okay. Okay, he said if you would like to order, hug, please email John and read the comments. Okay. Thank you. Okay, yeah, that's it right there. Okay. Oh, you can just leave oh, it was messed up. Oh, okay, because I was just inside the hook. Oh, that's what it is? Oh, yeah, it's the hook. Oh, you're fine. The hook, this is the actual Tunisian hook. Oh, oh but the hook is caught. It's fine. All right, guys, so this is what I was talking about, the, the honeycomb stitch, okay? He said, a crochet, yeah. Can I please have the coffee? A crochet thong, guys. This guy is super silly. You some nut, some nut went over there talking about that. Yeah, this guy is super silly. He went on there talking about that guy. Who did? I don't know who it was. He said, yes, Tunisian crochet. I loved it, but... It had me tense up. Oh my goodness, sorry, Angela, I had you tense up. But I was on, but imagine me being on the live screen doing it. That was so crazy. I'm so glad I kind of caught on a little bit. I took my time because I was getting kind of confused, but I ended up figuring it out. He said, oh my Athena, that color is gorgeous. That will make a beautiful summer top. Oh, I was thinking so too. I think so too. So yes, Ms. Ann and Joe. Mr. Joe, I enjoyed your video of the fight. Oh my goodness, thank oh, you, thank Lane. you, Lane. I yes. really appreciate that. Huh. Lana said, Joe, you are the nut. <laughs> Who was that? Who did that? This guy right here. I can't believe somebody would do stuff like that these days. These people are crazy, ain't they? Mm. These people get out there and they just say anything that comes to their head. And my my swatch got a little messed up, guys, but this is what we did over at Lana's. Um, she still has a, has a video up, so if you guys want to try some Tunisian crochet, learn all the different stitches, she has it up there, guys. Really, if she's at Just Frog It, okay? Noni Mae's got her link coming in, guys, so you guys make sure you get in her family. She's a sweet, awesome woman. She's also doing the Christmas fairies. If none of you found out about that, um, July, Christmas in July, Christmas fairies, all right. <laughs> Christmas in July fairies, guys, go over there and check her out. So look at this, guys. This is a simple stitch. Then I did the knit, and then I started doing a little bit, uh, what was I doing after this? Some pearl. I started doing some pearl stitching, and it really looks like a real knitted pearl, like when you knit, it looks amazing. And then we went over and saw what the back of them look like. If you do a simple stitch, this is what it looks like on the back. If you do a knit stitch, it looks like this. If you do a pearl stitch, it looks like that. So that came out really good. And then she taught me how to do the honeycomb. Well, just not me. She taught us all how to do the honeycomb. But I fell in love with it. You see, your curtains <clears> behind you look like, yes. And that's, what, oh, it sure does. You're right. You're so right, Angela. I'm addicted to that honeycomb. The side dude, that guy sounds like me. <laughs> Only thing you got to do, Lana, is keep them nuts off your page. Talking that stuff about those thongs. And everything can be perfectly fine. Oh, my goodness. You said skip the first 15 minutes as the tour goes until at least an hour and a half. Yeah, it's super fun, y'all. So look at this right here. This is what I did on the honeycomb. I got super addicted on it, to it. And I figured I wanted to make like a some type of cowl or something with it, guys. Look at that. Well, I think I got it upside down. Do I have it upside down? Or no? 
No, I don't have it upside down. Okay. So this is what it looks like. And I am in love with it, guys. It's beautiful. There's a lot of good texture there. And it looks like it could be a really nice beanie or a cowl or ear warmer. Um, and it's very, uh, like I said, the it's very woven. Look at that. It's a very closed-in fabric. Um, and I like that, especially like winter months. There's no spacing. I'm, I'm learning that a lot with this Tunisian crochet. There's not a lot of open gaps. And it's really, really nice. Even though you use a larger hook. You know, like usually when you use a K hook or something like that, you're going to maybe think there's going to be a little bit of a space or, you know, this right here is really tightly woven. I love it. All right. Y'all showing some love. Thank you so much, Denny. Yes. 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 Kelly's in the building. How you doing, Kelly? How are you doing? Did you ever film your video? I checked you out. I was trying to see if I found anything. I don't think, I don't know if I looked yesterday. I looked Saturday. I didn't see you, but I don't know if you did anything yesterday because we were kind of filming a lot of videos and I haven't been able to check. The honeycomb curtains and crochet thread, genius. Ooh, that is a great idea, right? So, Heather, are you telling me that you like to use crochet thread to make stuff with? Oh my goodness, you say you're bowing right now? <laughs> yes, Lana's an awesome teacher, guys. Y'all will have an awesome time. You go over there and enjoy her awesome tutorials. She makes some really beautiful things. Again, just them nuts want to wear thongs and stuff. Crochet thongs on her channel. Ooh. Denny, I am doing fine. I thank you for asking. Yes. Oh, try this a dishcloth. I think that would be great as a dishcloth. You said nut nut butter, Joe. <laughs> oh my goodness. Lana is awesome teacher. She she goes slow and explains it. Yes, she does. You said I guess I'm going to get a bowl of cereal. Oh my goodness. Denny's gonna get some cereal. Yes, Denny, that sounds really good. What do you guys have for dinner today? Did y'all have good dinners? Um, this guy barbecued today. It was amazing. I had to do my niece's hair, which I got half of it done. Um, and then tomorrow I'm going to start it and finish it up. But he barbecued um, sausages, hot dogs, hamburgers, pork chops, and steaks. I don't, the kids wanted all this type of stuff. I got, he went to the store with both of my sons, guys. And these guys were in there like they were carnivores just ready for meat. I don't understand where all these meat ideas came from because I don't even think we're going to have side, a side dish. <laughs> it's like, oh, let's have all this meat. I don't know what's going to happen with all that, but... <laughs> Yes, a bowl of cereal does sound great. I do. I definitely love my bowls of cereal. What is everybody's favorite cereal? I have been really getting eating a lot of Fruity Pebbles lately. I really love Fruity Pebbles. You said I, I had American chopped suey. Ooh, that sounds amazing. Uh, my husband, my father-in-law, used to always make chopped suey when Joe was coming up, right, babe? Mm -hmm. Hamburgers. All right. You said I haven't had dinner yet. I for, I forgot one time. I forgot one time it is with this midnight sun happening. Oh my goodness, really? Yeah, I don't know much about Alaska and everything, but uh, I know our time is, uh, we have a big difference in our time because Laura can go live right now and the sun will be out right now. Just, you know, it's like, what's going on? You guys want a preview of the hook? Sure. Let's take a preview. Oh, that's gorgeous. Oh, my goodness. Oh, wow. That is gorgeous. Glitter. About to get rid of glitter, guys. Oh, wow. I thought there was a little glitter in there. It looks like there was a little bit of glitter in there. Yeah, it's very little. Oh, God, I'm going to say it looks nice. It was on the table already. He said crab. Oh, my goodness. What is going on? Tunisian crochet tablecloths all the time. Really? So I'm coming to visit in LOL. All right, you're more than welcome to. You're more than welcome to come visit all the time, Christy. I promise you are. So Jax is, I saw crab, so I just had to hurry and go to that comment. <laughs> crab, fried rice, cucumber salad, and quick kimchi. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yes, definitely there with the crab. And then I was surprised to find out I have some crab in the freezer. Didn't know it, but somebody surprised me with some, guys. I'm addicted to crab. I really am. And I love my lobster tail. Can't deny my lobster tail. Even though I wish... I don't know if the lobster tail and the crab, which one has more meat. Crab, I can't... Uh, my son's like crab has more meat, guys, so... Put the top end and then no. Yeah, it has all the rubber. I don't know. It's I don't like, know. Which one has more meat, guys? It depends on how big you get them. I don't know. I'm not so I'm telling you that it depends on how big you get them. Crab, Go crab, them crabs in the freezer right crab now. Crab legs, lobster tails. I don't know. He said, I have to get my smallest Asian hook out to use for crochet there. Oh my goodness, that's going to be amazing. Heather, I would love to have some fun with it and just see your work. Cocoa Pebbles is my favorite. What? The chicken looks so good. Thank you, Barbara. He said, who is the one? Who is that one for? No one. It's not for anyone. Um, Like I said, oh my goodness. Like I said, guys. 
It's not for anyone, but he will definitely make them for anybody who wants them, guys. Just glitter it, guys. Look at that. And like he, like I said, he's going to be doing a promotional, uh, a promotional introductory price. He's going to be doing an introductory price, guys, because everybody been, been wanting them and everybody wants to support us. So I appreciate everybody who wants to support us. It means the world to us, guys. Um, many of you know we're trying to save for a car. We need a vehicle to be able to get around, dropping the kids off of school, working. Um, all kinds of stuff. We need a vehicle to and from church. We need a vehicle. And so many of you know that. So many of you have been really like just sending us love offerings. I mean, you know, purchasing our items, going into our shops, you know, and just wanting different things. And we appreciate that, y'all. So Heather says, I want lots more teal in my. Okay, so Heather wants more teal in hers. Okay. Sunset is 12 39 a.m. tomorrow and sunrise is 3 a.m. Really? Wow. So it really has changed. So does that, I guess, does that happen like twice a year? How does it work for you, Laura? When the, the time and everything, how the, you know, sunsets and the sunrise and everything. You said, I used to love Apple Jacks. Now I'm on completely into oatmeal and cream of wheat. Oh, that does sound good. I got you. Kelly, yeah. Cinnamon Toast Crunch, yeah. My daughter loves it as well. So I played yarn chicken and lost my yarn. Was this going to, no, Barbara. Yeah, I played the yarn chicken with that gold poncho. And I, I don't think, I, I mean, I, I guess I semi kind of won because the yarn was so stretchy, but I ended up doing it like maybe two rows less or one or two, one or two rows less because I usually do uh, 20 rows. And I think I did, um, I think I did about what 18 rows. I think I did 18 rows and it ended up coming good. Okay. Love it. Love it. Love it. Awesome. Awesome work. Uncle Joe. Oh, Kelly said awesome work. Uncle Joe. Thank you. Thank you. Thank I you. want it. I need it. Oh my goodness. Jennifer said she want and need it. He said, Barbara, thank you so much for speaking on it for speaking how you are doing. Oh, yes, it is so sweet. Yes, Elaine is very sweet. She's a big supporter. He said, will you be posting the hooks on IG? Yes, I will be posting them. I will definitely. I got to get some pictures of them. That's what I got to do. Oh, my goodness. Woo! Woo! Thank you, Jax, for the Thank love. Thank you so much, Jax. Thank, Thank you, you. Jax. You just made our night. Thank you so much. I appreciate it so much. We both do. Thank you, Jax. You are so sweet. He said, I'm so great. I'm so, I'm so green. What is yarn chicken? Well, I guess we're just playing yarn chicken. If you're creating something, say you're working on a hat or you're working on anything and you eyeball some yarn. You're like, oh, this is all I have, but I really want to make this hat, okay? I think I have enough for it. I think I'm going to, I think it's going to be okay. So you're going to play yarn chicken because you're eyeballing it to check and see if you have enough for said project. So you don't really know because this is all you have. And sometimes you win because you're like, oh, yes. I had enough. I didn't have to go out and buy anymore. Um, whatever else. Um, and if you lose, you end up coming up short and you don't have enough and you have to add something to it to make it work. Or you just frog it and make something else. Which is frogging is just tearing it out and taking it down. Okay, so yes, because I love cream of wheat. He said, maybe my, my hooks, if my hooks have play handles, I won't use them so easily on the guy. Oh yeah, that may help. That may help. Heather. Yes, you said our dog at daylight time is every gradual. Oh, it's very gradual, coming from three hours of daylight on winter solis, solstice to twenty one hours of daylight and summer solstice. Oh, wow! So I never knew. I, you know, I don't know. I guess everything is different. Um, so far as when it comes to that, we do like the daylight savings time. I don't. So I'm not really familiar with like how what you got going on over there, Laura. So that's really nice to learn. So ooh, the uh, Heather that's... just said she wanted the teal hook. Yes. Yes, Heather. I am actually going to go and get some some new teal yarn because the ones I had, I really didn't like it. And it ain't really teal teal to me. Okay. I mean it's teal if you can see. I don't know if you can see it that close. Where's the other ones? Uh, right here beside you, babe. Right beside you. Okay. Let me see what I got in here. Okay, so yes, I'm emo. Okay, thank you so much, Jennifer, for emailing it. We appreciate you. Okay, so the day after summer solstice, we start losing daylight. Really? Oh, yes, it is. So yeah, it's like the day after we um. Well, I don't know if it's a day after, but once we go into the what the daylight saving time, and we go in from the November when we I think ours goes November and April, I believe April and November we go we do an hour change, which is not probably as big as yours. Cause you said you you go by three hours or something. Yeah, you said going from three hours of daylight. So, yeah, we just do like one hour. So, you talking about three hours. That's crazy. Said too many rows of frog. I need some denim roll with it. Oh, okay, yep. That would be good. Get some denim, Barbara. You can do this. Yeah, Joe, mix some green and light green and light blue. Ooh, that would be nice. Oh, green and light blue is nice. Yeah, so this one, was this like the earth one? 
Oh, no, this is like, this teal one. That, I mean, that's, I. that's kind of like the teal I have right now, mm -hmm. but there are several colors of teal you can get. Yeah. What is that one color they said do er earlier? It was like a real nice. I got. I can go back. Oh, the sun. I can look at it. Okay, like the little. Um, I think that was me. Was that Mimi? Mimi was talking about some different like a uh, sunsets or something like that. He said, "Lord, that's fascinating." Yeah, it is fascinating, isn't it? That's why I love when I talk to everybody because everybody has some good like you know different things that's going on. Because I don't you know I don't know about Alaska or Pink you know different states. Pink, orange, and green. You said whatever you call the blue green that's on the one with the stars. Okay, whatever the ones with the stars. That. Oh, one. okay. The one with the stars, this one, you're talking about this one with the stars. Okay, so this one with the stars is just like a regular green. Okay, yeah, I definitely got plenty of greens. It looks I got, like a teal. I got every green. single color, guys, so that's not, colors is not a problem. Yeah, it looks like a, it looks like a teal with that, um, in the lighting. Is there any teal in here? I think it's just green. Yeah, it's I think it's just green. green, but I think it just the looks like. The lighting makes it look teal. Yeah, it looks like a teal, but you can kind of see, if you look at the bottom there, it looks green. So I see, I just missed it. Joe, that is beautiful. Thank you. Make a galaxy one. Okay, make a galaxy one. Am I fa Okay, hey. Oh, Hello, Jeannie. Welcome in. How are you doing tonight? Truly really appreciate you for being here. This is, uh... So I really like this, the colors with the, the ones with the star. Just move. Okay. Just move. Yeah, that's not a problem at all. Mm -hmm. I was just experimenting with some different shades. Mm -hmm. and Because I actually, I actually want to do one where there's actually more shapes on it. But it will be kind of smooth be more shapes on it but you'll be able just to see the shapes mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. i'm it's just gonna be like it's gonna be very where it's like together more mm -hmm. so i'll do like a bunch of hearts but it'll just be like real close together mm -hmm. and you'll be able to see the shapes real good summer solstice is just a couple of days away after summer solstice we will lose about 17 seconds of daylight then each day will continue to lose a bit until we get about six minutes a day Wow, that's so crazy. I got this. That's so simple. That's so different. Say, so, yeah, hello, girl. Hello, Danny. Say, hey there. I tried to test and I tried my test and it works. I'll be going live tomorrow to dye yarn with Kool Aid. I'm so excited. All right. You said that that's what that with the yellow and coral is beautiful. Oh, really? Thank you so much, Heather. You said those are beautiful cooks. Did you? You did a great job. Oh, thank you so thank much, you. Kathy. Wow, is that I how do you seal them? Oh yes, you got Ginger, welcome in. How are you doing? Um, you seal them with a glaze. You want to use a glaze, right? It's called a glaze, right? Yeah, it's called glaze. So not feeling my hubby is very sick per oh my goodness, yes. Wow. Yes, we definitely will be praying for him. Oh my goodness, yes, we're definitely praying for him. Oh my goodness, yes. So maybe I will do a video. From summer solstice to winter solstice. Oh, that would be amazing. Oh, wow, that would be amazing, Mimi. He said, yes, then do another one for winter. Oh, that would be amazing. Because I would love to see that. He said, I'm totally going to visit. I know. I like I never knew anybody who lived in Alaska. Um, I'm telling you, maybe until a few years ago. And then I started meeting so many people on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and finding so many people who live in um in Alaska. And I'm like, really? And I'm always thinking, oh, it's so cold. And a lot of my friends were like, okay, there's cold times. But there's times where you can go out. Like my friend, she lives um, near a beach. And she's visited beaches and had a ball. She's like, oh, me and my family, we go to visit the beach. And we go to, I'm like, I'm thinking it's freezing there all the time. And she's, I mean, having a ball. Hello, Karina, Anna, welcome in. How are you doing? Thank you for being here. Yes, yeah, Proverbs, no weapon formed against your husband shall prosper. Amen. Yes, yes, yes. Praying, praying, praying. You are so right. Let's see. Okay. I'm going to go do up a couple scrubbies before I, well, I have a little time to do this. And um, go from there. So what are you all working on? You said, oh, you're in the North, North Pole. What? Yes, yes, she's in Alaska. That's what I said. Yes, you love Alaska. Exactly. Because I met Shelly, and Shelly was there, and then I met Alicia. Um, I think I met Alicia first, and I met Shelly. And I was like, what? You know, I'm like, I never knew how common Alaska was to live. I mean, you know, how common of a place it was for people to live in Alaska. I didn't think it would be like, oh, you know, like a little uh, live spot. I mean, you know. I'm just, you know, being a kid and, you know, never not learning a lot about it. I, I always thought they said Alaska was too cold to live in. Yeah, I always thought that too. 
I thought you had to be like an Eskimo to live in Alaska. <laughs> they, they are, like, there's always this little myth, you know? Yeah. There's always so many myths about it. Like, I live in Indiana. People are like, oh, Indiana, it seems so country there. Like, you wouldn't, like, is there any, like, do you even have cell towers? I'm like, <laughs> like I've gotten it so many times. I'm just like, yeah, it's just, I live in a city, um, but it's not really much. You know, it's not really, it's pretty simple. Okay, you say yes. I sent you a message and send me your address. Okay. Oh, okay, you send me a message. Okay, Did you, where you send me a message on? I got probably, I don't know, probably Facebook or Instagram or I'm not sure. I gotta go check. I was doing my daughter's hair, my niece's hair today, and so I hadn't really got a chance to do any like um checking up on anything. He said, "Love the rogue names in the North Pole." Really? Wow. See, I know so much about this stuff. It's amazing. The like Kelly Stutter used to live there long ago. She just went back. What? Yes, that's a crazy. Working on a shawl and bloom morning glory. Oh, really? That sounds amazing. That really does. So what kind of shawl is it going to be? Are you, is it a surprise? I don't want to, I wait till you, you know, post it and everything. Hello, Lori. Welcome in. How are you doing? You said, enjoy your fried chicken. Oh my goodness. Thank you. Yeah, so glad I caught y'all again. Thank you. I'm so glad you caught us as well. Thank you so much. Maxine's here. She said, who's from Alaska? We're just talking about Seta being living there. We're talking about our friend Alicia lives there. Laura's from there. She's at Crochet. She's at um, Mad Mimi Crochet and Farming. She's up in Alaska right now as well. Yes. Okay, I'll go to your channel and leave my email. Okay, yes. That's great. So I'm working on Granny Squares with Scrap Yarn. Is that Proverbs? Yes. Facebook. Okay, cool. Thank you so much, Jeannie. I live in Tennessee. People think that we sit around the porch chewing on tobacco and picking band. Oh my God. Like, I'm telling you, like, we don't know. We always get all these little different little movies. It kind of gets portrayed in movies or whatever else that we're just like, you know, no one really knows. And so we meet somebody from there. We're like, no, we're, we're actually, uh, I guess, kind of normal. <laughs> uh, he says, still working on a baby blanket. Okay. So, Kelly, what's going on with the channel? Are you going to be starting your channel soon? Are you still going to be uh, working on doing that? I can't wait to hear more about it. He said, I think I should go ahead and take a chicken out of the freezer. And so thought, yes, Heather, take it out. Chrissy, I'm going, I'm giving you the side eye, girl. You know, you know, that's how it is. <laughs> I'm knitting this shot. I'll show it in my next video. Oh, yes. Everybody who's not, it's not in um, Jennifer's family. She said, Froggy went a knitting. She's going to be sharing her uh, shawl that she's working on. She's doing a giveaway. Um, join her family and just have a ball over at her channel, guys. I definitely will be, I will be there. So don't worry. Christian's in the building. Hey, Christian, how are you doing? Everybody, welcome, Christian. Super sweet young man. Uh, just really, really awesome. He loves my work and I just love him as well. He's really good. He's been doing a lot of videos on Instagram, guys. His editing skills are off the chain. I really would love him to edit something for me because. You does such a great job. Can I ask a question before you get started? Yes. Okay, guys, I got this co these Here's two it. colors. Oh, where am I? Right there. I got these two colors right here. I want to put two more colors with them. I want to try something different. I'm going to put the two more colors in it. What you think? What's the two more colors that could go with this? I know it kind of looks funny on the screen a little bit, but. It's like a baby blue. It's like a baby, baby blue uh, and a uh, royal right blue. Yeah. So tell me that. All right. So, yeah, from Mississippi, I get that. Do you? Barbara, do you get that? He said, I went to Indiana last year yeah. for the first time. Tobacco yeah, Day chicken, retrieve. Yeah. It was free. Yeah. What? Tobacco yeah. Day had a retrieve here? My chest my door. Yeah. Can I have a drink of this, please? I had no idea. What? Really? Seriously? So sad. I missed that. Oh, you created a channel? Okay, so you, you create a video? I mean, I'm, I subscribe to you, but did you ever create your first video or anything? I mean, or did you create... Is it this channel right here, Kelly, or did you create another title, another channel name? That's what I'm trying to figure out, Kelly. Let me know. Tammy's in the building. Hello, Tammy. He said, just popped in to see you all. All right. Mwah, mwah, hugs and kisses. Thank you, Tammy, for the love. Thank you for popping in here that thumbs up. I truly appreciate you so much. Okay, so yes, Kelly said she's going to have to hope to have a video up by tomorrow. Sounds really good. Say, when you make the poncho that you have on, do you chain three or five? My poncho seems to take a while to make since I only chain three as required. Yes, I definitely chain three. Sharon, I would definitely suggest if it's taking a long time and the chain three looks weird or it's not enough, make go up a hook size. It's a really, it's hard to crochet loose. This pattern calls you to calls for you to crochet extremely loose, and of course many of us are not used to crocheting like that. 
I usually try to tell people to crochet like you are allergic to yarn and you can't touch it and you just, you know. Um, but like I said, go up a hook size. Maybe that will help. Go up to an L hook, maybe, uh, uh, which is an 8, M, eight millimeter or if that's too big, maybe a seven, 7 millimeter. Some hooks kind of go, some hook sizes or the European packs, they have a 7 millimeters in those. So I'm trying to finish my top for Thursday. It's my birthday. What? Happy early birthday, Jeannie. Yes, I'm so happy for you. Thank you so much. I'm super happy that is your birthday coming up. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Jeannie. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Jeannie. Happy birthday. So we said black and yellow, pink and black. OMG, I would love to. You are so sweet. Oh, thank you. Is that Christy, you know, I was being fresh. I live in Massachusetts. <laughs> Is that the yellow and coral look awesome. Thank you. Making ombre. Yellow, yellow. Everybody saying yellow, yellow, purple, or something. <laughs> yellow, black, or navy, a dark color. Okay. Good. Gold and dark blue, maybe. Yellow, pink, orange. How many people think a hot rocky desert? Think of a hot rocky desert when you when you say California. Haha, <laughs> I think one percent Arizona and Nevada people only. Yeah, when I think of when I think of Arizona, I feel like there's no houses anywhere. It's like big open deserts, like the little uh, tumble. Well, no, that's Texas. I don't think about tumbleweeds. I feel like there's little cactuses everywhere in um, Arizona. There's like this big open desert land and like. Maybe a house here, a house there, like not no neighbors, like you don't see anybody. I don't even know if there's, I guess there's stores there, but I just feel like there's just open roads and lots of deserts everywhere. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I just feel like that. We got purple, purple and yellow. Everybody show some love. Good night, Shelly. Love you. Sweet dreams. Thank you for hanging out. Thank you for always being a supportive friend. I appreciate you. God bless. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Froggy went to knitting, said she wants me to sing some gospel. Yes. You said that poncho pattern is so simple. Once you get hooked on it, you'll be able to make them in, in your sleep. Yes, you will be able to. Jeannie, welcome in. Hello, how are you doing? Jeannie says, hello, babe. Hello, Jeannie, how are you? You said, oh, it makes your arm sore. Oh, yes, it does. If you hold your arm up and you're like, it definitely makes your arm sore. Hello, Sandra SC, welcome in. How are you doing? Hello, yes, new to your channel name. Oh, my goodness. Okay, your new channel name is Kelly's Crochet Adventure. Okay, all right, now I got to make sure I'm in there with you. Okay. All right, yes. Okay, so everybody show some love. Yes, oh, sweet Joe, thank you. Jeannie says, thank you for the happy birthday songs. Everybody show love. Yeah, you're very welcome, Jeannie. The Chit Chat Queen's in the building. Hey, Chit Chat Queen. Chit Chat Queen, say hello. Hello, how is she doing tonight? Okay, let's see. Everybody show some love. I'm going to think of California. I think of an overcrowding shortage of water. Really, do you? <laughs> you said, I think of an overcrowding shortage of water. Wow, my sister lives in Arizona. Mimi, California, the new Cali looking like garbage. What? Really? Well, I want to think of California. I just think of like movie stars and big open, beautiful houses with uh, palm trees and like different, different. I mean, just like everybody walking around with shorts, flip flops. So I just got back from Arizona. It was like 108 degrees. What? So I might be able to finally teach my youngest to crochet. What? She was asking for something with lots of chains. Oh my goodness. That's going to be amazing. 10 people need some thumbs up, family. Oh, thank you so much, Rosemary. 10 people need a thumbs up. Thank you, Rosemary, for getting everybody a thumbs up. I appreciate that. You guys are amazing. But yeah, like you said, um, that would be great if you can get your family, your daughter or your youngest child to crochet. I remember I got my daughter to crochet, and um, she hasn't crocheted in a while. <laughs> I got her started, and then it was just like, oh, okay, I'm over it now. He said, I'm shook. Y'all could call my state out like that. <laughs> Kristen, we don't know. We, you got to tell us about your state. Come on, tell us about your state. Tell us about, well, um, Chelsea Loves lives in California as well, so she knows about it too. Because I just got back from Arizona. It was like, how did you do about Arizona though? He said, okay, so Arizona is very nice. My son lives there. Okay. See, that's what I was thinking. I didn't know. I'm just thinking it's like this open space where nobody's there. That's all. I don't know. You said, I, oh, you skipped over somebody. Okay. You skipped Sorry. over. I got to sing her a song because she's asking me to sing her. Okay, yeah, yeah. No, you said that. So I was waiting for you. You said you was looking for uh -huh. songs. I was reading. Go ahead. Very good. Because I take the coat over the heat any day of the week. Really? Mind me. 
I don't know what I can. I don't know. I don't even know. I don't. I guess I don't mind. I, can, I mind the hot because I don't. I can't go outside, but I got, I have central air, so it's not too bad. But I don't know. I don't know which one I would like. I don't really like the cold either because I don't like freezing. Uh, I don't know which one I would like. I don't know. That's very long. He said, honestly, all looks the same. You said all looks the same? Oh, okay. <laughs> Arizona is extremely hot, but not humid. Oh, okay. Yeah, because one of my friends was, lives in Arizona. One of my um, crochet friends. I met her on Instagram. She's like, it's, it gets hot there. You said, and tumbleweeds, Auntie Dana, LOL. I know. <laughs> I was thinking about tumbleweeds. Okay, you, gonna, you got some longer already? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Who can stand against the Lord? No one can. No one will. Who can stand against the king? No one can, no one will. Oh, 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 victory belongs to Jesus. Victory belongs to him. Oh, 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 oh. Victory belongs to Jesus. Victory belongs to him. Who can stand? Who can stand against? Nobody can. No one. No one will. Yay. Who can stand? Who can stand against? Nobody can. No one will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, uh oh, 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 victory belongs to Jesus, victory belongs to him, oh, uh oh, oh, victory belongs to Jesus, and victory belongs to him. There you go. All right. That was awesome. 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 <laughs> yeah, that was crazy in the comments. Laura's talking about if you are cold, you can snuggle to get warm. Once you are hot and naked, you are still hot and naked. <laughs> that is so true. And Lori says, hey, Joe, how about something about the name of something about the name Jesus? He said, I live in California. It's desert lands like Arizona. Only when it's 105 there, it's 101 here. Arizona is booming like Cali, but hot, but with a breeze because we are 3,200 3, elevation. Oh, so y'all really, oh, y'all really hyping the air? Is that what you're saying, right? Yeah, it's heat rises. What? Wow, I don't know. Like, that's why I always, I, like my mom, she went to visit Florida. She loved it. I mean, well, she thought she was going to love it, but when she got down there, like I said, she went on the beaches. She had a ball, and it was just nothing but humidity, and she was like, oh, we can't sit outside. I love to, she's like, I love to sit outside, I love to, you know, get air, have my coffee in the morning. And she was like, I have to go get coffee early in the morning because once, you know, the day becomes, it gets a little bit, you know, later in the day, it's humid. I can't sit outside. I have to stay in the house all day. I can't even enjoy myself. Like, she was just, oh my goodness, she was just going in. He said, beautiful, Joe. Thank you so much. Yes. Thank Jennifer you says, so much. Jennifer says, thank you for singing. In time. Okay, so you're in Roseville. You said it's not that hot there. Yes. Okay, so that's good. And also, Christian just graduated, guys. So shout out to Christian. Christian graduated. Yes, yes, yes. So happy for you, Christian. Well, of course, like we know with this time that's going on, we don't have really traditional graduation ceremonies, guys. But we still are going on to a new level of schooling, guys. It's always an amazing accomplishment. Two, four, six, eight. You said Joe hit the ramps and Kirk something in the name. Something about the name to you. Yeah, he said, that's here too, really. <laughs> he said, 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. is inside hours for Florida. Wow, I know. That's what mom was saying. She was like, and then it was crazy because she would call me maybe 5 or 6. What time would it be? About 7 o'clock. I think it would be about 7 o'clock. And it would be like super dark out. And I'm like, what? She's like, and we'd be sitting outside on the porch. And she'd be, like, if she goes outside on her porch and talk at the same time, it would be so dark. And I'd be like, wow. She's like, yeah, see, I told you it's really dark here. I'm like, wow. I'm like, she's like, I'm not used to that. I'm not used to being 7 o'clock and having to be in the house. Because she doesn't like to sit out in the dark, you know. She didn't really know a lot of people there. 
you know, sitting in the dark, you know, you're a, an older woman, you don't want to be out in the dark, and, you know. So she was like, I, I can't sit outside at 7 p.m. And, you know, it was just hilarious, then. Yeah, she said, I can listen to Joe sing all the time. Oh, thank you so much, Jennifer. Thank you so I truly much. appreciate it. Yes, he definitely, he comes on, he sings, and, you know, we craft, have a ball together. Really fun time. Making up some goodies. I'm working on a little scrubby. I have to get some stuff done for a craft fair. For those who don't know, I'm doing a big craft fair. It's not even just a craft fair, guys. It's going to be like this big art beat. It's actually called Art Beat. And so there's going to be, like I said, singers, dancers, cooks, and handcrafters. Um, and so there's going to be people that's probably going to do crochet. People that's probably going to do some beading, some knitting, maybe some ceramics. I'm not sure what all they're going to be making. So I have to really kind of come with it, y'all. And I got to figure out how I'm going to display it. They said you have to display your things in an art form or art fashion. So I'm going to figure out how to um, how to display my items. So that's my biggest thing I'm going to be doing. He said, yeah, 7 p.m. sitting on the porch with a sweet tea, a fan, and a bug zapper. Oh. Ooh. And Heather, we just got introduced to us um, to the bug zapper last year. We were at our pastor's house, and they had bug zappers. They had went to a store called Ollie's, which is probably maybe 30 minutes away from us or 40 minutes away, I'd say. We didn't know about it, but they went there and they were like, you know what, guys? That's what we just got. They were like, look at these. And we we're like, where are those tennis rackets? I didn't know what they were. <laughs> and we were sitting out. She's like, we're going to try this out. And they were holding the button down. And you're like, zip, 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 zip. And I was like, what is that? And they're like, these are bug zappers. And they were just zapping bugs. And we were, it started getting darker and darker outside. So we're sitting on our back patio and we're just like, like just doing this, holding the button down. And next thing you know, like, pop, pop, pop. So every time we hear this pop, there's a bug being zapped, okay? So that's like a mosquito or a fly. I mean, it was just, it was just, they work really good. I don't know, has everybody ever used the um, bug zappers? Because they work really good, y'all. Especially if you like to sit outside. You know, if you like to sit outside, you can, um, you know, enjoy it. But you don't have to worry about getting ate up. And then we got one of those light, like a light um, zapper. So there's like a little hangable light. And all the bugs, it's a fluorescent or whatever kind of light it is. And they all swarm toward this light, guys. And so it kind of... Get you get away from you, and it goes toward the light. So I like that. So let's keep sweet seeing our prayer. She's not. Feel, oh, thank you, Denny, for letting me know. Yes, we'll keep her on. I did not know that. Definitely okay, we'll yeah, I know she's been kind of. You know, I thought she was getting better, but maybe, she, like you said, definitely we will definitely keep her praying. Up. Wow. He said Joe's hooks will fly off the table. Wow. Well, Joe's like hooks. Yes, they will fly off the table. You're so right, Rosemary. Thank you. We are going to be like I said. I'm going to get some pictures taken of them. I haven't gotten a chance to do that. So that way people can go ahead and get them. Like I said, we're going to have an introductory price um, just because, you know, he's a newbie and he wants to be a blessing. And we're just going to be doing our proceeds going to our vehicle because we're really trying to earn, get a new vehicle out so we can be able to travel. Before school starts back in really heavily and all these activities we got going on, right now we're able to get rides for certain things. But for the most part, you know, we're stuck. <laughs> So, cause yeah. my mom would come get us, but our car, her car is down like right now, mm -hmm. and then my mother-in-law works and has stuff she needs to do. But my mom don't work, but my mom's car is down right now, so that's 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 like double trouble. So, oh, so Lord, the bug zapper doesn't work for your skeeters. Um, it kind of works for our skeeters, I think. It works for our skeeters. It works for mine. It works for our skeeters. Well, I'm gonna be honest. There was a couple different ones. My my our our pastors had a really good one. I'm gonna be no, honest. We had a good one too, and we had a good one. We they had a good one. We had a good one. Then Joe went online to order some guys, and they weren't good. And let's just say that no, they didn't work at all. No, they weren't good. They was, was like we say, you know, sometimes we like to get the cheap stuff, but sometimes you get what you pay for because those babies didn't zap a thing. I'm gonna be honest. They were just decoration. Yes, get you one. Yes, you said I think of sinkholes when I think of Florida, and Florida probably thinks of Cali for earthquakes. Really, yeah. And I think about Cali earthquakes definitely, definitely. Every time you watch a movie, you're like, "Oh my goodness, it's gonna be an earthquake." And you said, even though both are rare, so you don't even get earthquakes like that, really. And I remember the sinkhole that happened in Florida. Well, I don't know how many have happened there, but I definitely remember at least one or so that they were going. A lot of sinkholes were happening. So hi, my grandpa had these things that looked like old lanterns that hung up and attracted bugs and zapped them. Really? Yeah, you remember those things? I kind of want to say I do. You remember those things? They used to hang up, they go, yeah, pow, pow. We have one of those. Pow. We have, we have one of those. But yeah, we got the light thing, not the lantern, not the lantern shape, but apartment feels like I seen them and I didn't know what they were. You know, I didn't know what they were. I think I saw them. I was like, you know, you see certain things, you're like, I didn't know, I didn't know what it was. I've been a kid, you don't know what everything is. And sometimes I ask questions, sometimes I don't. 
Uh, oh, whoa, oh, look. You said we have a bug gun that shoots salt. What? Oh, my goodness. It's a bug zapper, a legal taser. Oh, my Man. goodness. <laughs> uh, but the thing is, I don't. Did it zap your skin? Did, did it zap us before? What? The bug zapper. Did it hurt your skin or anything? No. You said, my husband loves to sit and zap the bugs. Really? Yes. We were having a ball. We were at our pastor's house. So probably like eleven thirty at night, just like swatting and swap, and we were like the last two there, and I don't know, but they were kind of having a good time. They didn't kick us out, but we were sitting there just having a ball. Use these hooks as a form of art and lay them next to your crochet items and make hooks of. Oh my goodness! Thank you so much, Rosemary. See, I love these ideas. I need every idea I can get, y'all. I'm kind of nervous about this thing because it's really big, and there's gonna be people from different states, you know, coming to visit. So I gotta make stuff for different climates, you know. So I'm making sure because I know it's gonna be going into the fall. But there's still people that want to, you know, dress like that till, because our state really kind of gets starting to get chilly about what, maybe end of October. Well, mm -hmm. yeah, probably by end of October it starts to get a little chilly, and so I want to get some stuff, you know, they can wear in the summertime. People can take back to their hotter states, all that good stuff. So thank y'all for the ideas, y'all. That's beautiful earthquakes and sides. Oh, forest fire. Oh yeah, yes. Oh look, then he said Joe needs to ride a bus. <laughs> You used to have the hanging kind as well as the racket kind. Oh, really? Mine has it all. He said, do you have a shop, Joe? No, he does not have a shop. Um, we just have an Etsy shop on creative, on Creatively Creative Crochet on Etsy. Um, I have all the information in my About tab. Also, the last fried chicken video. I don't have them up on Etsy yet, but I do have them there. Um, so you can, um, you can either send an email that way because I have an email. Um, in the in my last the last chicken video, um, and that way I usually always send out invoices through PayPal, so you can pay through PayPal, where it's a really secured paying. You know, I really I really like that because I know it's a, you know, PayPal is really insured, and insuring by what you know. He said yes, Joe. Do you feel like singing a bit? Yes, yes, he has, he definitely feels like singing a bit. He said, do you feel like singing? Yes. He said, my hubby is a salt gun. He said, that's rough when your vehicle is. I know, you're right. So I've never been through, oh, Kristen says, never been through an earthquake. Junior, he's getting an Etsy store up and running. Yes. Okay, thank you, yes. I thank you so much. Yes, that was beautiful. Okay, so Elaine heard. Thank you, Elaine. I live in California, and we have quite a few earthquakes. Really? Oh, my goodness. Yes, so Karina, I don't know. She knows about those earthquakes. Is it ending in November lately to start getting chilly? Yeah. He said, oh, yes, fire and mudslides. That is true. Every year that will happen for sure. Yeah, when I think about mudslides, I think about chocolate chip cookies um, melted mm. with a bit of ice cream on top and a drizzle of chocolate syrup. I haven't eaten yet. No oh, idea. Eat a sausage. And a hamburger. Oh, and a hamburger. Mm. But that was a lot earlier. <laughs> we normally have a couple oh, feet of snow oh, on the ground oh, by Halloween. And it's so crazy a couple times on Halloween. We got like really heavy snow, y'all. Like seriously, like blizzard snow. Like we usually get rain, but like the couple years in a row, we got heavy snow. He said, Dana, with PayPal, if you have some people send it as a gift, they will not take any money out. Okay, yep, exactly. They will not send the money out. But I like to do it as a business. Um, that way I can send the email to them, and that way if it does take money out, I'll charge an extra fee. Um, let them know that you know it's gonna be extra fee for it if you do use pay PayPal, but it's okay because it's gonna cover your insurance and make sure you know I don't jip you or anything like that, which I won't, but we won't. Um, but it'll you know people feel a lot of people feel comfortable with PayPal. I definitely do, um, and so I like to do it that way. But like I said, if it's somebody that you know for years or something, um, and you know they can say, hey, I don't want to care about the fees, just pay it as a friend. Um, they don't, I don't mind that either. But I like to do it with when I can send out an invoice. It makes it a lot easier. That way they can see what they got going on. You know, they'll be able to see it all, you know. They'll be able to see everything that they're paid for. I said, y'all are two night aisles. When do y'all go to bed? We go to bed, Kelly, about 5 in the morning. About 5 in the morning? Hello. 5 or 6. It's summertime now, so there's really the sky's the limit when it's... <laughs> he said, yes, I was born and raised near San Francisco, Earthquake Central. What? Yeah, oh my goodness. So, I guess we got a lot of people, a lot of Californians in here. Oh, wow. He said, are Joe's hooks Susan-based boy? They are boy, um, but they can be anything. If anybody has a certain choice, they're more boy boy type. Yeah, but if you well, they're all know. boys, but they can be, you know. Yeah. If anybody has a preference on them, he can get whatever you guys want. Whether it be crazy all year round. Yes. 
this weather this year was crazy because it seemed like it was, it didn't want to get warm. And it's still, like now, it doesn't want to get warm. Okay, it's June, like the middle of June. And today, it was probably like maybe 70, 80 degrees or 70 by 70 something. And it just dropped down tremendously. At the end of the night, it just drops. I'm like, you got to have a hoodie on, coat. I mean, you can have all that. I'm like, what is going on? It's June. Y'all, I'm sitting here working on this shawl. And y'all food talking. Y'all food talk make me hungry. I know. We always get into that food talk because we eat so late. And so everybody's like, y'all, it's talking about food. But it always happens. So sorry, Christy. Don't get hungry, though. Please just plug our ears. Hey. He said, I live in. Oh, beautiful. Hey. Yep. Yep. Kristen does live in there <clears throat> as well. Nana's hands lives there as well. So we got a lot of Californians. I live in Blue Ridge Mountains of Virginia. Usually snows in December, sometimes in November. Yeah. Like, oh, so, yeah. I got a couple people from Virginia on here, too. So, yeah, like you said, when it's not, like, I guess December, November, that's good times, you know? But when you're talking about snowing earlier, it's like, what is going on? I usually try not to ask any questions, but it's just like, it's a big surprise most of the time. He said, Denny, sorry, I'm looking just down and listening. What did you say? Oh, okay. So I live, love it. Negative 86 degrees. <laughs> Cause I'm, I'm getting ready to go to bed. Okay, Kelly, sleep tight. Gotta be working seven. Yeah, get some sleep. Thank you for hanging out. Appreciate you. Hugs and kisses. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Be blessed. Kristen said, I love the Oh, you love the cold? Yeah. Mm -mm. Kristen, I can't do the cold. I don't want it to be too cold. Um, but I guess the weather here has been pretty nice lately. I'm telling you, it's been nice. But the cold, I can't do it. Here it's hot, and we haven't seen summer yet. I know we haven't seen summer. Oh, uh, it's hot there, and you haven't seen. Oh, woo. Oh my goodness, yeah, we haven't seen summer yet either, but it's not extremely hot. We have kind of like a little, little something, but it's not, it's not, like you said, it's still not summer. Oh, you love fall? Yeah, I, I think I like spring weather. You know, sometimes spring can be kind of snowish. But I think I'm going with spring. I think I'm, I'll do spring weather. Yes, and I, Kelly, yes, okay. Dana, I go to bed if I'm, do you, Christy? Oh my goodness, yes, yes, because Christy came into live, we was hanging out. We hung out. We said two, four, six, eight, ten, and twelve. Hi. Yes, I'm just making up some scrubbies, guys. I gotta figure out all kinds of stuff to make up. Better pack my bags and fly down there. Oh yes, come on and fly. Come on and visit. How's the family doing, Kristen? How's everybody doing over there? I need. Oh, Peter, so yeah, I'm I'm gonna be making up a poncho, guys. Um, do you think that's a good idea to give away a poncho? Because a lot of people love the poncho. I know some people uh, just don't want to wear it. They you know, don't want to make them themselves, but they do like them. So that immediately gave me the idea, like, oh, I would give away a poncho. And then Joe was like, you know what? I'm going to give away a hook with it. He said, hello, my zapper just went, just went off. Really? Oh, there it goes. Yes, Jax. I was raised in the north of you guys. Went up, oh, 101 in the Redwoods. Moved to South Cali 20 years ago when I was moved out of my parents' house. Um, I'm gonna say a quick talk with Vivian. Later. I hate summer, Vivian. I mean, what else is saying? Oh, that was Elaine earlier. Elaine oh yeah, and then she heard you sing because uh, she's a little behind. Oh, but you can definitely sing again. I, uh, I hate summer. You can only take off so many clothes. Oh my goodness, yes, exactly. You can. <laughs> you only can take off so many. My bad. Uh, you're fine. That's what I was telling you. I think you missed me. I said it was like right after. Okay, it was like right after. Cool. You said I will purchase a poncho from you. Oh, okay. Yes, I would love that. Thank you. Thank you, Christian. Yes. Okay. I think that's a great idea. I love your poncho. Okay, yes, I'm so glad that y'all love this idea. I'm thinking about making a poncho. Looks like I could make it in a day. Then have, yes, Heather, most definitely. He said, Dan, you, could, you might do a headscarf crochet for your fit. Ooh, thank you so much, Barbara. Sounds like a great idea. He said, summer, uh, I'm telling you, Chit Chat Queen, I have been, for summertime, I, like I said, I like to stay wet. I like to stay in the water. We have water balloon fights. Oh, my son has a little kiddie pool. I'll dip my feet out in that. I can't do. I can't do it. And like I said, I'll stay in the house for the most part until the sun, you know, kind of dies down or whatever. Because I can't do it. What about you, baby? Do you like the sun? Yes. Yeah, okay. He used to like it too. You used to love it. Now I don't think you like it like you used to. You want to sing? You want to sing or something? No, I'm just chilling. I thought I thought Elaine wanted me to sing. You definitely can sing. You can sing. I mean, you you know. Oh, we got a new person here, Cheryl. Hello, Cheryl. How are you? So I like shawls and wraps better than ponchos, do you? Yes, and that's why I want to get into making more shawls. 
I definitely want to get into making more shawls. I see so many of my crochet friends making shawls, and I never get to make any. Um, but I do have a pattern for one that I really want to try. But like I said, I really want to um, want to get some more shawl making. He said, do you make small stuff, t toy stuffies? Yes, I have made them, but I haven't made any in a while, but I do make them. I make a little bit of everything. I want to make a doll. That's one of my next, well, one of my next stuffies that I make is going to be a doll. He said, I can't do cold. This girl need heat. I'm not, like I said, I can't be, like when it gets started getting cold here, y'all, I think the coldest I've ever remember seeing was what, maybe below 100? I can't remember. I think maybe below 10 or something. Below 10, below 12. Yeah, it was like below 10 or below 12, y'all. And I'm telling you, we couldn't go outside. We couldn't, I don't think we can go outside or not, can we? Mm -mm. Nope. Uh, we couldn't go outside. We, we had to stay in the house. There was no school. I mean, it was just horrible. And when you went outside, I know what it feels like to be frostbitten because it was like your skin was burning. The snow was burning your skin to go outside. Horrible. He said, gotta get something to eat. Okay, all right. See you in a little bit, Laura. Get you something to eat. Get your grub on. Awesome, y'all. Thumbs up. Okay, thank you so much. Joe, did you ever look into the song I, I, I was called, for, I Forgive Me? Oh, did you ever look into that song? Dana, do you knit too? I just started doing a little knitting, no, I didn't. Lori. I didn't look into it. Guys, I've been doing praise team stuff lately, so I got so many songs in my head, I can't really look into like side songs right now too much. Well, because I got a million songs that I'm working on the praise team with right now. Like a bunch. That's the reason why I sung that song right there because I'm been I'm working on a lead to that song, so it's coming along though. Okay. No. I'm fine. I'm, I was just saying it's coming to it's coming along the lead. It's coming along pretty well. He said, "Are you kidding? Our kids here go out for recess at 20 below." No. Did you hear that? No, that's crazy. 20 below, y'all kids go outside. Yeah, our kids cannot go outside if it is less than 35 degrees. They have to stay in the school. So you want to go outside at 20 degrees? That is crazy. Oh, well, sorry, no, it's what? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> 20 degrees? Oh, I mean, are you serious, Laura? Because I got to know. Are you serious? 20? Oh, my goodness. That's frozen crazy. kids. Yeah, that's frozen, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> the kids out there frozen. Icicles got no, their nose are yeah. a little snotty. You got the snot sickles. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> they out there, they're there shivering with the snot sickles. The snot snickles. <laughs> yeah, they got the little they got kids in the snot snickles. <laughs> they come back in there. <laughs> Miss Johnson, can I get some tissue for my <laughs> snot snickles? Yeah, it's below 10. No, I can't even take 50 high. Oh, my God. <laughs> Josie laughed so she can't even take 50. 50, she's like, oh, no. <laughs> Oh my goodness, wow, that's crazy. Is that, we would never go outside. <laughs> no, oh no, I couldn't do it. No, no, no. Hello, sis Rachel Joe Walker. How are you doing? You said, let me see what you said. I missed you, okay. Love your curls. Thank you so much. Oh, I appreciate the love. Yes, yes, yes. Did you happen to see the chicken video, the fried chicken? We're trying to get up to 500 views, guys. So once we get to 500 views, we got another video coming soon after that. Um, we're going to be dropping that one right away as soon as we get to 500 views on the chicken video. And I wanted to ask you guys a question. I'm going to go back and read some questions, guys, because I love you all. Read some um, comments. But we are about to change our channel name, guys. Okay, Creatively Creative Crochet will still be the company name for all things crochet and crafting. But as you all know, we do a little bit of everything on this YouTube channel, guys. So like I said, YouTube, Creatively Creative Crochet is not changing, not leaving. But when it comes to this channel, it's not just me that is on this channel, but I am having the awesome pleasure to do this with my husband. So, guys, many of you already call me Triple C. Many of you know that is my nickname. Just because I have three C's in the company name. So, we're going to be changing this thing to the Triple C and Joe Show, guys. So, that's what the name is going to be, guys. So, um, I don't know if they're going to have it when you change when you type in Creative Creative Crochet, will it still pop up? But that's what's going to be the new name, guys, because I'm not in this thing alone, okay? I have a new partner now, and he's going to be bringing a lot of different things to the table because he makes a lot of different things, and he wants to share it, and I don't want him to have his own channel. No, I'm just kidding. I do want... 
Now, I don't really care if he has his own channel, yes, but it's going to be lots of managed, though. Yes, she do. It's going to be lots of managed, guys. No, nah, she don't only have my own channel, yo. <laughs> no, nah, I really don't, but still. Everybody said, like, that's cool, cool, cool. You could make it creatively create crochet and Joe. That is true, but that's why I said Triple C in the Joe show, because it'll make it, I think it's going to be too long with creatively create crochet and Joe. Yeah, who said that? That is Heather. You said, mm -hmm. I like you. said, just look, I looked at your video at, was 215 views for the chicken. It's 215? Okay, we're getting up there. Okay, so Karina Anna says, okay, and also Karina Anna, I got to message you again. Your view, I haven't seen anything, but I'm going to, I'm going to talk to you, okay? So you're going to get your goodies, but please forgive me, okay? Team Triple C, love it. Okay, yes, nice name change. Okay, so that's cool, cool, cool. Yeah, so everybody's loving it. You said, made me think of Mama's Chicken. Oh my goodness. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. All right, sleep tight. Okay. You got to go sleep. Okay, good night. Get you some good rest, Christian. I thought you was going to be hanging out. Christian, you supposed to be hanging out. It's, it's early in California. It's about 1 o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> Every time I talk to somebody in California, I'm like, oh, it's 3 o'clock in the morning. Oh, yeah, it's just 1 here or just 12 midnight. I'm like, really? Okay, so everybody showing some love. You said, okay, let me see what y'all saying. Um, you said, y'all are so funny. Uh, okay, let me see what everybody's saying. You said, yes, I'm serious, 20 below, and they are outside. The kids are not happy <laughs> if it hits 21 below because they can't uh, go out, really. Oh, my goodness. But I guess maybe it doesn't feel that bad compared to ours. I don't know. They're just used to it, I guess. No. Next, so sun hats, dish cloths, dish towels, scrubbies, scrunchies, magnets, summer shawls, summer scarves, baby item stuffies, bookmarks. Bookmarkers. Um, what else is there? It's coffee cozies, plant pot cozy. Wow. See, that's all. Jennifer, you just said a beautiful and nice amount of goodies. That's perfect stuff, right? Isn't that right? Mm -hmm. Wow. You said, okay, I saw I saw that big macaroni and cheese and I can't wait. Oh, yes, Heather's already on it. Heather's like, I saw that big macaroni and cheese. Oh, Lord said, do y'all eat oxtail? Yes, we definitely eat oxtail. This guy makes a mean tail of ox, right? <laughs> he makes a mean tail of ox. <laughs> I'm going to be really honest with you. I'm sorry. I'm not trying to talk about food, but. I never knew what oxtails were. He was like, oh, I don't got some oxtails. I'm like, sounds a little weird. Gonna be honest. <laughs> don't do tails. But, um... <laughs> and he got me to try them. Like, even when he made the turkey tails, he's like, oh, I make um, I make my grains with turkey tails. I'm like, mm. don't do tails. But he got me into eating tails, y'all. I never was a tail. I never got into tail. <laughs> <laughs> I never got to tell you eating before. Sorry, guys. Excuse me. I have eaten a lot of tails in my life now because Excuse of this guy. Me. You said it was great. It was in the 50s day and it was great. What? Okay, that's awesome. Okay, yes, yes, yes. Everybody show some love. Yes, you love it. Okay, he said, are you going? Are you going? Or are we going one? Okay, no worries. My friend talks to me anytime. Okay, okay, Karina Anna. I did not forget about you. I didn't forget about anyway. I still have earrings and stuff to send out, guys. Y'all had me hungry, LOL. But you know what, guys? For anybody who's got earrings, who's got giveaways coming. We haven't had a vehicle, guys. We haven't had a vehicle. And then I ended up getting, when we used my mom's car yesterday, guys, guess what I did? I ended up getting a couple things so I can write handmade notes in, kind of make the package a little bit better. Um, so that's what I had to do. I had to get make my package look nice, guys, because some people have channels. And I really don't want to send you guys something really horrible, and then you're like, Oh, this is all she gave you know, like she just opened up. Oh, she sent me this package in a um Kroger bag. <laughs> I didn't want it to look like that guy. I wanted y'all to be able to have open up your package right on the thing and it would look deep, you know, pretty nice. Worth showing, you know. I'm like, oh <laughs> like, I don't even have a bag with me. I wish I had a little Kroger bag. Oh, here you go. I was like, oh my god, this got my package from Creative Creative Crochet, guys. Oh, and it came in this awesome Joanne's bag. <laughs> I need something better than that. So I had to make sure I, you know, gave you something really nice. You said you should do an oxtail video. Oh, okay. So Lori said, throw, throw them oxtails in there. Get them tails done. Nah, I definitely will. Yeah. Would you like just, uh, what would you like, an oxtail over rice? Or would you like an oxtail soup? Or would you, how would you want it? You want it, what type of oxtail would you want it? Just let me know what, what, uh, how would you want them? <laughs> Trisha Queen said, y'all had me hungry. Yes. And so for anybody who's in the partner playlist partners, guys, there will be another playlist coming out early in the morning, guys. So you guys will get that. Um, and that's because we have some new people coming in and we have some old people getting out. No, I'm just kidding. But seriously, there's going to be some people that are leaving due to what they have going on and perfectly fine. They may be back. 
But in the current time, we got some people that are leaving, but we are replacing them rapidly. They're right. They're actually really replaced right now. So I'm going to be getting that list together, sending that email out tonight. So you'll have it early in the morning when we wake up. Um, just because we need loyal uh, people that are just committed and have that time right now. And like I said, life happens. Also, for those who are doing the uh, playlist partners, Saturday and Sunday will be off days. That is correct. Saturday and Sunday will be off days. It's kind of getting hard to do every single Sunday, seven days a week. Now, I'm not saying that you can't partner up with someone on your own because, hey, have your fun and do that because it still is great for you to be able to do that. Um, but some people, it just makes it easier. Summertime, sometimes we forget. Whatever happens, makes it easier. Just five days a week to make it so much easier for everybody. You said, weren't sure if you were shutting. Oh, no, no, no. I'm not shutting down. No, no, no. You said you were saying bye to someone. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was saying bye to someone in the camera. I'm sorry. You said, I want greens. Ooh, greens. Yes, Jennifer, that sounds good. Greens. I think greens would be good. Greens would be definitely be good. Yes, the greens will be good. You said, I am crocheting with Dollar General bags now. Plarn. Ooh, has anybody else ever made Plarn? Definitely. You said, Danny, you need to watch this video of mine. Outside Fun 32 below. Oh, my goodness. Everybody, check out this video. If you're not in a part of uh, Mad Mimi's family, guys, she is over at Mad Mimi's Crocheting farm Farming. Her name is Laura. Many of her friends call her Lala. Lala, Lala, Lala. La. Okay, but yes, she has an awesome video, guys. It says Outside Fun at 32 Below. I got to check this video out because I got to see this. I have to see this. I want to see like what how would the snow, I mean, what it looks like out there. I'm just curious to see this. Patricia's in the building. Hello, Patricia. Hello, how are you doing? Thank you for being here. Joe's over here getting his hook on, y'all. He is hooking it up. He gets more work done than me on his lives. That's why he's over there quiet. And no, can, I'm quiet because she she take all the talk. Yo. She talk. She do all the talking. Well, I'm I'm in, I usually talk to everybody until you're ready. So I can't say nothing, guys. Okay, I'm gonna be quiet. See, we gonna say anything. No, nope, I'm done. I'm working now. I'm too late. You were working. I always try to entertain while you're working until you're done. So you want to show something? I'm working now. I'm too late. We had a whole system we were doing. I let him work, and then he was ready to come show us some stuff. I will let him have the floor. I'm working out. Really. Can you show them what you what did you just do? Oh, you want to show them the next thing you I'm did? I'm glazing now. I'm glazing Tell now. us how to make up his mind. Okay, you said make sure you look at what I'm wearing. Oh, my goodness. I can't wait to see that, y'all. Please, if you're not in their family, please go ahead and show some love to my girl, Laura. Please, y'all. Y'all can. She got great videos, y'all. She, she, she has great videos. And like I said, she does a lot of vlogging like me. Where you're gonna see a lot of everything, you know. Well, I don't know. I can't say it's extremely like me because I know she has a nutso husband who gets in the videos. <laughs> but she does have videos where you're gonna see her farming lifestyle. She got her beautiful animals, and they have some really awesome names. If I was to have another child, I'm done. I'm going to get my own channel. I'm done. Creatively crochet. That's what this channel is. If you want to cook with Joe, I will have my. I got my own channel. I'm about to drop my link. Oh, drop it then. It's over. Drop it. It's over. Can't take it no more. Talk of abuse. Anyways, like I was saying, head over I to me. Never me's. talk. Come on and talk. Okay, nope, nope. Nana's hands in the bill. Say, Nana, please can you get your son in I'm line, getting, please. Nana's hands. Please get your son in line. Please help me. I'm getting my own channel. Ooh, look at Chris. He said, I smacked somebody's mama for a honey bun. <laughs> Now that sounds good with some little warmed up with some milk. Okay. Yep. Y'all can come over to my channel. Y'all can get honey buns. Y'all can get whatever y'all want. Yep. From today on, Lana. From today on. So since today is officially Tuesday. Right, Lana? Is it Tuesday where you are? You're not overseas. In the <laughs> Anyways. Yeah, it's Tuesday where you are. Um, But Maxine, I don't know what, what day is it for Maxine. It might be already Tuesday. But it doesn't matter. Saturday's not here. So everybody can know. From now on, when this Saturday comes up, we won't be on. Sunday comes up, we won't be on. But like I said, if you have somebody you want to run them or, you know, whatever it is, if we if we got somebody in our group, right, and they say, oh, I have so many hours up to be monetized. For those who do have that free uh, device and have a little bit of free time, they think about, like, oh, such and such is close to a thousand. I'm going to run them for this weekend because I know it's going to help them get close to a thousand. That could be a project that we do for those who are free and, you know, are, you know, going away from their devices or can run a device. And that can be something we do too. We know Charlie's close. She's close to her um uh her four thousand watch hours. Um, you know, and then Jill's gonna be coming up. You know, so we do have some people that are gonna be getting there. So we gotta help we can be able to help them out. 
he said waving as high family so now the sense, how are you doing i'm so glad i didn't get to really greet you because when you were coming in your son was over here acting crazy and you want to show that channel. i'm done he says he's making his own channel guys so he's leaving me um but you want to show your hooks off he said danny you nope. can throw a glass of water and it freezes oh my goodness lana we did that what was that a couple years ago babe you talking to me oh my gosh help me See what I got to deal with here, guys? This is what I got to deal with. Can you please tell them what we did with the yeah, glass? We, we threw water? a glass of water in the air and it froze in midair. Can you tell us a little bit what we did with it? How many times did we add color? Come on, tell some people what we did. Okay, this is my last thing I'm saying on her channel. Okay, so what we did was we put a little food coloring inside of inside the water and we threw it in the air. And the, the color froze right in dead air. Okay. Let me show you. Oh, you make your own channel for real? Yeah, Oh, okay, yeah. So, like I said, when he gets his own channel, I will not be supporting. I will not be liking, sharing any of his videos or commenting. I got my own. I got my and own. I will be hiding him off of my channel, so you will not be able to see him in my That's comments. Okay. I got my own phone. <laughs> I got my son to edit my videos. Oh, okay. So anyway, let me go everybody good, saying. Though. Now his hands, he, is, he was getting mad at me because I was not letting him have the floor when he was talking, guys. He was... He was doing his thing with the hooks, guys. Like I said, he was over here creating hooks. And his hands, these are some of the hooks he created over the weekend. We got some shapes now and glitter. Did you actually show him my hooks on your channel? Please. <laughs> Can you please not show my hooks so, on your channel? I wasn't giving him enough time to talk. I was thinking he was working, so I didn't want to disturb him. Can you please not show Since my I did not let him have any time to talk, he got a little perturbed and got quiet. And um, he stopped talking and he told me that Can I wasn't not letting him talk. So he now wants to have his own channel. Can I please show <laughs> do my own? He wants to have his own channel called Cooking with Joe. Lana says, yep. "Left him there." Song with Joe. There you go. Yep, cooking the song with Joe. You already got it. You already got the name for me. Y'all greater you. when y'all stand together. Thank you so much, Lana says. <clears throat> yep, Lana says, "Nope, y'all greater when y'all stand together." You said that one is my favorite. Oh, Heather said that's her favorite one, but she wants it smooth, but she wants more teal in it. You still showing my hooks on your channel? I'm gonna show it again. So I, Karina, the I, Lord I wants you together. Thank you so much, Karina Anna. I you are too cute you. together. Thank you. I'll report you then. Yeah, I wish Denny was still here. Denny would put you in a headlock. So, yes, guys, I'm just doing these little scrubbies, y'all. I'm just having a ball making some scrubbies up. I got the scrubby yarn, and like I said, it's cotton. It's actually cotton, y'all. And I remember the first time I ever made this. This is exactly what I'm using right here, y'all. I'm going to do a, another a video. Oh, see, look, they got the towels, too, y'all. I never made them with the towels. I probably used this up a full, full skein for this towel. But this is a cotton. I usually use this regular scrubby by Red Heart. And so um, I love to use this because I have actually used them. You know, when you make certain things, you don't actually use them. But this is something I use. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 22. I actually use these in my house. Um, and they work really, really well. And my mom was using them too. I made a couple for my mom and my mother-in-law as well. They work really good. They're not too abrasive, but they do help scrub off countertops, stoves, sinks, pot spans. They really work really good. I haven't used this cotton, though. And a lot of people um, said they use this with regular cotton as well. Like, you know, your kitchen cottons that you can buy. They add a level, a layer of that. Well, not, let me say one strand of that as, long, as well as a strand of this uh, scrubby. You said, I can kill... 1,002. I can get 1,000. And two can demolish 10,000. That's what I'm talking about, Nana Sands. Is you what Nana Sands Are you ready to do your own thing? No, I'm not. Oh. I thought you were just kidding. No, I'm done. Okay. Do your own thing, man. Let's see. Um, So, I usually... I have a tutorial for these, too, y'all. I really have a tutorial for these. They're really simple. Nothing, really. That's when I was doing my first, my first tutorials, y'all. And I was doing these and um, some little simple tutorials. I'm going to be doing some really bigger ones too coming up. Everything that I make my crochet, everything like uh, Jennifer, she sent a beautiful list of stuff I can make for this craft fair. So I figured everything that I make, y'all, I'm going to, if I don't use someone else's pattern, I'm going to create patterns for them and do tutorials for them, y'all. So y'all can see, um, y'all can see what I make. And look, okay, so Chelsea Love says you can do two channels, but both. Of you together. Joe run his cooking and you as his sidekick. And he be on yours on the Triple C channel. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah. If that's what if that's what he wants, that's what he'll get. 
Whatever Jojo wants. Do, 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 do. Jojo gets. <laughs> he said, I like to use one strand of that cotton with a regular cotton. Yeah, Lord, that's what somebody else who just said that. Was that Shelly? I feel like I'm going to say it was Shelly T. And I never have done that before. I usually just use it like this. Two, one, two, one. I usually just use it like this and, you know, go from there. I'm not doing that channel, no way. It says, hi, sweet. Oh, my goodness, Julie's back again. Hello. Welcome in. How are you doing? He said, Joe, I want some chicken. Ooh, look, everybody's wanting that chicken back. Julie said she wants some chicken. She wants some chicken? Yes. Were you just looking <clears> at Julie's <throat> comment? I think you were just looking at Julie's comment, weren't you? Yes, I was. Okay, you said, I came from, I came for the chick. Zigzag even came back for the chicken. How you doing, Zigzag? How are you doing? Thank you for coming in again. How you been? Long time no see. He said, look at Joe Powell. I know, look at him. I'm not Powell. I was just kidding. I hope he was kidding, guys. <laughs> but yeah, guys, I'm just going to make, I'm making up a ton of stuff. I want to do market bags. So you guys are going to see me do different things. If y'all have any ideas, I'm going to throw up a couple yarns. Because the other, the smaller yarns are going to be for y'all poncho. When I do this poncho giveaway, I'm going to try to pick. I'm going to do like a little video or whatever. And you guys can pick which one we'll do. And we're going to make it up. Look, uh-oh, Zigzag. Look, Jax, you remember Zigzag? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Jax, remember Zigzag? You said, well, doing very, okay. Oh, so you've been pretty busy, Zigzag. What you been having going on? He said, we are all coming for chicken, mac, and, oh, yeah. Yeah, it's Jennifer. That's going to be a good, that's a good uh, actual, a good dish that we all make really well. So I want to see Joe take a big bite out of the chicken. Oh, I know that's what I said next time. I said, we're going to start doing where we take bites out of the food and stuff like that. I think that would be good because I like to watch video movies like that or TV shows when people take a bite out of it and you can just look at it. It's so juicy and tender. Okay, sorry. Do you have a pattern for a market bag that you like? Oh, do I have a pattern for one? I have a lot of different patterns that I bought over the years. So I'm thinking about making some of those. Uh, using some of those, but I, I may make. I'm thinking about uh, making a, a coin purse, or not a coin purse, but like a little in between coin purse slash, you know, like a little small, like a nice little cute bag. I'm gonna make up, but I do have a lot of uh, market bags too. My husband has his own channel. I record sometimes. Oh, do you? That's so sweet. These are making face scrubbies. Oh, makeup removers. Oh, yes. I'm making these are gonna be like little kitchen scrubbies, but these can be face scrubbies too. Because I never use it with this cotton, Lori. I've always done the regular scrubby. It's a little bit more abrasive. And then I've done the scrubby sparkle. The scrubby sparkle, my daughter says she likes that a lot because she's our dishwasher. And she said it works <laughs> really be much better because it's a lot, um, it's really scratchy. He said, now I just need to learn how to make collard. I have a whole meal there. Oh, really? So, babe, what do you think about that? The collards? Making some collards? Yeah, collards are easy to make. Yeah, so yeah. I think that, yeah. Oh my god, y'all y'all gonna y'all gonna be in for a treat because guess what we did last night? We actually filmed four videos, four food videos. Y'all, we were up all night, babe. I was traveling with the lighting set all in the kitchen, y'all. Y'all would not believe it. We filmed four food videos. So we're trying to get this other one up to five hundred views and then we're gonna drop the next one, y'all. I'm telling y'all. We were up super how long how long late was we up, honey? Huh? How late was we up? It's about we was up to about four or five, but we hadn't slept that much. Which one? We were up oh, right. really late, just having a ball. But we did good. We tag team the meal, and then we um we made all the videos. So Heather said she's seen them already. I made I took a picture of a plate, and I was like, "Videos coming soon on all these dishes." So all those dishes, we actually recorded the video for each one. And like I said, everybody who's been watching these videos, guys, many people cannot eat salt, and I understand that. That's why we said make it. You basically have the basis for it, and you can just add all your seasonings. Now you just know the process for it. But you can add whatever seasoning you want. You can omit it. We all know these types of things when it comes to food. Um, we can follow recipes, you know, just basically for maybe a ratio or cook time or whatever. You know, maybe a process of it. But we can always make it our own by making our own, you know, flavors to it. Okay, let's see what everybody's saying. Here's scrunchies with soap with scrap yarns. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. I haven't made scrunchies. I haven't made scrunchies in a while. So, Chrissy, that is so awesome. You said, not, okay, all right. You said, yes, new to the channel. Oh, my goodness, Clumsy Mumsy. Welcome in. I'm so sorry, and I hope you're still here. I'm so happy that you're here. Thank you for being here. I'm Dana. This is my husband, Joe. We're here doing some crafting. My husband's making hooks over there, and um, he's really addicted to doing the hook handles out of polymer clay. He's a really good. I'm going to show you some more in a minute. I hope you're still here. And you said, showing your beautiful Clipso earrings. 
Thank you. Oh my goodness. So you made them? Um, you got to make these, uh, you got to make the, um, earrings. Are you in the, uh, crochet group? The greens are my favorite veggie. Really? Yes. YP Joe. Nana said, said, YP Joe. Yes. Yes. Said, Jeannie said, wow, my internet is <clears throat> bad. Hey, Nana's ass. Thank you so much for being here, Jeannie. I appreciate you. Yes. You said, you are all on a roll. Thank you so much. Do you bake? Yes. It really happened off. I used to always be the baker, y'all. That's all I ever did. I baked and Joe cooked. I could not cook anything because I was always having everything turned up to the sky high. I didn't know what I was doing. All you would hear was a smoke detector going off, and I would be scared to death because I'm like, what did I do? And some people know the story already because they were here. I burnt down my kitchen at the age of 17. I was, I was trying to make donuts. Had a nice recipe. I had the dough. She's in the donut. I was trying to make donuts, guys. I had the dough ready. I had let it roll, rise. I, you know, cut off the pieces. I let them rise again. And so I decided to go ahead and um, dump the donuts into the oil. It was ready. Next thing you know, I had the grease up way too hot. Smoke detectors going off. Flames began to rise. And I didn't know what to do. I was at work. I was working at Ponderosa Steakhouse maybe about a week ago. They had a grease fire. And my boss says, throw milk on it. I didn't look and see what kind of milk was being thrown on it. Because <clears throat> 9 out of 10, it was probably a powdered milk. Some type of powder was thrown on this. Okay. I'm guessing. Uh, I didn't know that. I thought it was a liquid milk. Uh, my mom, I, my, I was just at work and I told my mom, I said, mom, my, my boss put milk on it. And she said, okay. Whoosh. Fire went up the walls, up the ceiling, all over the cabinets. My mom grabbed the pot that the donuts. <laughs> I'm trying to say it without laughing because it's so funny that I went through this. She grabs a pot that had the donuts in it and she throws it outside. The whole cabinetry was all burnt up. I don't even know how to fire. I don't even know what happened. I don't even know. But it was just crazy. And um, I ended up painting the whole cabinets all over again, y'all. I'm sorry. You said, I'm sorry. That face made Joe make. Um, yeah. Clumsy Mumsy. This guy is really good at those faces, y'all. He really is. He really is. He really is, y'all. He said, I'm sorry. That face. Oh, my goodness, y'all. He said, baking soda. Yes. Thank you, Heather. Thank you. He said, I'm going to try to sleep. Okay. Denise, sleep tight. Love you. We're going to be getting you prayed. We're going to be keeping you prayed up, okay? Love it. Gallon of milk. And I think it, was, it wasn't even skim milk either, was it? I think it was like a whole milk. So I really messed it up. Not water. I didn't know. I didn't know, guys. He wants to talk about me, but I didn't know. That's worse than the going to the store and getting chicken legs. He was going to roast me tonight, y'all, because many of y'all saw that story when I was telling you guys about yeah. I was walking around the store looking for chicken legs at the store because he sent me in a store to get chicken legs when we were starting dating. I had no idea what chicken legs were. I went around looking for chicken legs in his pack, going crazy. I, like, I want to impress him. I go back to the car and say, "There's no chicken legs in here. All they see, all they sell is drumsticks." Yeah, yeah. Okay, man. Okay, oh, we love you too, Nana's hands. We love you too, Nana's hand. You know you. You know we love you. You know. Um, mm -hmm. It's okay, baby. I'm sorry. Tell the people about the chicken legs. I told them about the the, the drumsticks. <laughs> Bowl cozies are big now. Mm, Bowl cozies. Bowl cozies. I'm trying to get Joe to make me a yarn bowl, y'all. Wouldn't that be fun to let him to watch him do that on live? I think I'm about to do it right now because I'm in another video. Oh my goodness, y'all. Joe's about to make a yarn I'm bowl. Make my last hook. He made his last hook, guys. Look at the hook that he just did. Can y'all see it? I'm sorry. Oh yeah. That is gorgeous. Gorgeous. Yes. It's a drum shit. Yeah, so he's gonna make a yarn bowl, guys. I'm excited. I need a yarn bowl. Okay, yes. Drumsticks, gorgeous. Oh, no. oh my goodness. Can y'all believe? I didn't know what I was doing. I did not know, God. I did not know. Everybody said pretty, did. purdy. Good night, Karina Anna. Love you. Thank you for being here. I don't know Thank I you did. for being so I sweet, Karina Anna. And I got to go back and comment on Karina Anna's videos because Karina Anna just released a couple videos. I don't know what I did with that black. What's the name? And I, did, I, I watched them, but I didn't get a comment because I was kind of watching them while I was working. Huh? 
I don't know what I did with that black, uh... Clay? I mean that white clay, that big block of white clay. I don't know big block? I gotta have that to do that. So. I think it's in his back. What's in his back? <clears throat> oh, me. Okay. Okay, is it in here? Here we go. Here we go, guys. Dang, I thought I got out. Ooh, look at that big thing. I thought that got past it, yeah. Uh, he was... He was trying to take his... Come on, he can do it. Guys, come on, let's cheer Joe on. He can make this yarn ball, guys. I haven't done this in years. He's going to make me a yarn ball. And can the yarn... I'm going to have a... Can I request anything on this yarn ball? Mm -hmm. I, would, I just want to be like a nice... What, what are you going to use in there? Going like to put something like this in there to test it out? Like to make how big it is? How deep you guys should think his yarn ball should be? About this deep? Clumsy Mummy said, beautiful. Can we buy them? The chicken... The crochet huts. Mr. Joe is making not the... <laughs> Huh, Clumsy Mums, yes. Clumsy Mums, we're going to have all the information. Um, we're probably going to put them on Etsy. We're going to put them on Etsy. Mm -hmm. We're going to put them on Etsy, guys. I already have an Etsy uh, channel. Yeah, Etsy, it's on the, like, if you go to the chicken website or the chicken video in the <laughs> <laughs> comments, in the comments below of that, in the comment or the description box. Just. Description? <laughs> Just in the description box of the chicken video, <laughs> you will see all the information so far as website, which is still getting there because I got my son, he's working that one for me. And right now he has a controller in his hand and it has nothing to do with the website. But I guess it's kinda it's pretty much almost done. But there's an Etsy page. I'm gonna put all that um information what there. Color you, want this thing? you gonna paint it later? I don't know. I'm gonna paint it. I gotta paint you got it before I put it in the oven. Oh, she's gonna paint it afterwards and then glaze it. I was confused, okay. Um, what else was you? I was thinking of something, you know. I'll think of something, y'all. Oh, yeah, you gotta paint it afterwards and glaze it. Okay, he says a Mandela yeah. is a cake. It's okay. All right, so Mandela cake is pretty good. They said this is pretty good. This is close to Mandela cake because Mandela has the same amount of yards. So this is gonna be pretty close. This is, um, what is this kind right here, honey? This is a cupcake by Lime Brand. Oh, you got those listening for me? Gay those. for his honey bunny. You got those listening for me, though, the. Those two you bought yesterday. Yeah, Joseph, give me this back from the dollar right here. Okay, yes. Okay, so everybody's saying yes. A little, a little bit more than half that deep. Okay, so a little bit more than half this deep. Okay, cool, cool, cool. And then we gotta make the little thing in the front. The little, and everybody said you can do it, Joe. Thank y'all so much for the love, y'all. Come on, me. Can you give me this right? You just said mommy. You haven't called me mommy a year. That's so sweet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, they still call me. Is that mommy, purpose. mommy? That's on purpose. Hey, give me this. Yeah, that. Okay. Hey, so this is what you're doing. That's on purpose. Oh, you can still call me mommy. Yeah, I said it. Oh, you can say you can, like you can call me mommy again. You can like a little water in the room. I was talking to you. Sell some yarn yeah, balls. Look, barber trying droppers that make money off everything. Sell some yarn balls. Like uh, a bowl of cold water. I ended up going to Dollar Tree, y'all, and I yeah, picked up some goodies. I was gonna put this in a yarn, uh, a Dollar Tree haul video, but oh well. I didn't get that much. So I got you some tools. Here go your tools, honey. I don't know what all you want here. Cause I got that one thing too. Cause this you might you might be able to put your um mark the size with this. You hear me? I gotta come out like this. Man. Oh my god, he about to, he about to, he about to do some stuff, y'all. So how big are, is that base gonna be? Is it needs to be bigger or, or wider? I'm trying to make you use up that whole pound. Yeah. Or is that two pounds? Okay, so do you, do you want to show everybody what you're doing as you're doing it? No. Or no? You gonna be shy? You gonna be shy? I ain't shy. Sure. I gotta, I gotta start. First. Okay, you gonna start. We'll let him start, and then he'll show us. But I end up getting some of these guys, some stationery, little note stationery. So I love when my babies call me mommy. I know, don't you love that? Love to be call me mommy. He's like, but he calls me mom now. I don't know where it came from all of a sudden, but like my daughter calls me mom. I think even our six year old start like they're trying to teach him how to say start call me mom. Like call me mommy. Like I'm mommy until you. <laughs> Go to see Jesus. Your name, my name is Mommy. And when we be, both meet there, with, and I come there with you, when you come there with me, so I better still be Mommy when you that, see uh, me again. So I can put these hooks on there and get them out the way. Hmm? Let me give me that uh, pan there. So I can oh, because you're going to do the, um, the steels, too. Right. Change your mind yeah, I'm going to do them later, but I'm going to mess with this boy. I want to try some. Okay, he's going to have this. I'm going to have a bowl, y'all. I might have one. I don't know if you're going to keep. You got to finish it when you use a, When you work with Clay, do you have to finish it in one setting? No. Okay, that's what I was I'm wondering, too. I'm like, do you, if you can you come back to it? Can you make it a whip? Is there a ceramic such thing as a ceramic whip? So me too gives me that warm fuzzy. I don't know, Barbara. 
So that's for, that's right. I'm mommy. Exactly, Heather. So I'm 46 years old and still call my my mommy. Do you? Yeah, because Joe's 35. He still calls my mommy. It depends on like he'll like text her mommy, but I'm thinking, well, he says mommy too. We call him. No, mommy. mommy. I call him mommy. <laughs> because he always used to call me mommy. So then sometimes I'm like, huh? Yeah, I call him mommy. But now it's, it's like he does mommy and mommy, mama and mommy, and then kind of calls me mommy too. So I didn't know this was a magnet, y'all. Love it. So this is really good. I guess you can put it on the refrigerator for, you know, like to let the kids know, take out the food, thaw the meat, or do the dishes. I like that. Cool. But I don't think I'm going to be using it for that. I want to use it when I send out my packages to send a little sweet love note for everybody. I got these. It says shoot for the stars. Um, let me see what oh, else I got. What did you, what did you want to say? What? Nothing I want oh, to you, say. No. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, baby. I don't know. I didn't know if you were going to say something. It says you go, girl. So I'm going to be sending these out. Like, I wanted to have a, a sweet little note when I send out goodies because I got some gifts that are going to be coming out. I got giveaway goodies, and then I got some surprise goodies to some of my favorites. Um, and a little bit at a time, I'm going to be sending out stuff to my lovies. And I stole your word, Jax. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I'm going to be sending out some little goodies to everybody because people have been sending me goodies. And I just want to kind of make a package up nicely. That's all I want to do. I got another one that says cool stuff. Different little rainbow colors on there. And I got another one that's little, pretty little roses and such. Flowers. I'm just thinking, I don't know what is going on there. Mm -hmm. And I love this because, like I said, oh, or you can, did you look up the name? What, is that what it was? That's awesome. Oh, you, you got this. You got this. This man is really good at that. And there's 60 sheets in every one, y'all. Is it any time, boo? I appreciate you. Oh, I appreciate you, too. I already said, my boys still call me mommy. They're 23 and 28. Fills my heart. I love, don't you just love it? Yeah, so I said, these are 60 sheets each. You know, I might need one for a note to somebody. I might do two. You know, but either way, I'll be able to give them a sweet little note. I wish I had some little cute envelopes, whatever. That's another day. I got some dry erase marker just because I like to do games. Um, we're going to be doing some different games and stuff, so I wanted to have my dry erase marker for that. What else did I get, honey? That was it? I got some. I got ink pens, too. Can you bring my ink pens and my little tablets? And the Dollar Tree is really taking over with yarn, guys. I'm going to be doing a giveaway. I mean, not a giveaway, but I'm going to be doing a yarn haul. Have y'all got any yarn from Dollar Tree, guys? Um, I'm just going to tell you one hint, okay? Because this video is so overdue. It's ridiculous. But I got this scrubby yarn from Walmart. I'm from the Dollar Tree. I got the scrubby. I went into the Dollar Tree. I went online to my Dollar Tree. They had some goodies there, okay? I'm not going to tell you yet because it's only been the haul video. But when I went into the actual Dollar Tree, this scrubby cotton was there. And I said, what? So they only had... Maybe like two or three skeins of this, Man, or balls. Making a bigger base, okay. I just, I just need to see some guys. I'm sorry, I may cut you off, but oh, I'm no, trying, you're fine. trying to see some. You getting, you getting a study on your researching on? I, I, like haven't, I haven't done it, made it one of these in, I mean, uh, a bowl in years. So let's see. Yes, I appreciate it, Johnny. Hey, you know can you give me this, um, this over here? Don't say, can you do it for you? Sure. Can you give me this tablet and stuff over here? Can you give me this? Um, the tablet and my ink pens that I got. So yeah, I was like, I love that for a dollar. I had to grab them up, y'all. Everybody that knows been going to the Dollar Tree and finding yarn. You know, and I'm kind of getting into ours. Don't have it really. You said that's so awesome. Dollar Store or Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree. And I end up going to DollarTree.com, y'all. If you want, you can go to DollarTree.com. No, I got a package of ink pens. Is that a package? Mm -hmm. Where's my package of ink pens? Right there. Right there. Yeah. Dude, can you get my ink pens? This guy is always talking about it's by your foot. Is this all of it? Is it missing one? I don't know. Open it. I mean, I opened it, but I'm trying to make sure they're all here. How many are supposed to be here? Eight. Eight. Oh, there's even one here. Ten. <laughs> I'm gonna make sure I got all eight here. Two, four, six. Ooh, I'm missing one. Oh, Thank you. Okay, and so I end up getting this. Give me my ink pen. Okay. Sorry, guys. This guy's always trying to act crazy. Is ours don't have it. So, yeah, and if you go on, if yours do have it, you can go online dot, or uh, DollarTree.com and you can send it to the store and you can go pick it up from there. Uh, and I love that because it's free. I don't have to worry about that crazy shipping, you know? So I do have to go, I have to go to dot .com. My store doesn't carry yarn. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't think my store carried yarn either, I'm going to be honest, no, um, yes. because they never used to. And when it did carry, it would be like some yarn that I was like, mm -mm. but it just so happened at this time it had some yarn that I could actually use. 
But when I went to the .com, they had some good stuff. So you're going to see that video soon. I just got to get it uploaded, guys. He said, Joe, can you put some saran wrap on a bowl, mold the clay over the bowl? Oh. Oh, Joe, yeah, I don't know. I mean, he probably can. He has, his little, he has a technique that he's been doing for years for his pottery. But he was just trying to figure out how big he wanted his base to be, right? Yeah. That's what he's trying to figure out how big he wanted it to be to, to start it. He has a really um, awesome technique that he's been doing for years. One of his faves. And he's going to paint this and everything, y'all. Can y'all believe it? So I ended up getting some ink pens, too, guys. I wanted some different pens. So when I send letters out to everybody on these little cute little, you know, I can write some little letters and some little sweet, sweet notes. It'll come off as a cute little package. You know, something nice. But, you know. <laughs> I figured I'd try to get it a little bit, you know, a little nice. And then I end up getting these little tablets. There's a dollar for three of these. I love tablets, guys. I'm addicted to tablets and paper. I feel like you never can have enough of it. I don't know why. But yeah, he's gonna be making on his working on his um yarn bowl. I'm gonna get some scrubbies done. And I wanted to think of something to make with this yarn here. I have a couple yarns and I, I'm gonna need some ideas if you guys can help me out. Um let me see. They're acrylic yarns, guys, so I know. Um I don't know what we can pick with them, but these two right here, these are what I really want to make with something with these right now. Um, and this is not an extreme amount of yarn. It's 177 yards, 177. I don't know why I said 177, but whatever. It's size four. I'm just trying to get some ideas what you to make. 77? 177. <clears throat> he said, what is the name of the chicken you do to video? Thank you. Oh, it is uh, Joe or how to make crispy fried chicken. If you go to my channel right now, if you go to this channel, it'll be... Right up under this video. Well, I don't. Yeah, it'll be right up under this video. Yeah, it was. We just released it early this morning. So both of y'all got gifted hands. Oh, thank you, Lord. Yes, we both do. And um, Joe ended up having surgery at the age of what, twelve, huh? Mm-hmm. And uh, you want to talk about it or anything or no? What? What the surgery? Yeah. I, mean, I don't know if you want to get into it or not. You're more than welcome to. Okay. I uh, I had surgery at the age of twelve, so. You want to show a little more? You a little bit on you or no? Uh huh. Oh, yeah, you can. Okay, I just want to go. Fine, baby. Okay. Yeah, I had surgery at the age of twelve, and I needed to. My mom wanted. My mom was trying to find something for me to do mm -hmm. while I had surgery because my mom always was the type of person that whatever. She's always been there for me, just one hundred percent. But uh, so she went out and she bought me some clay, and she bought me some beads. And I sit at home and I taught myself how to make all these different pottery bowls and um, just tons of different sculptures and like off of oven clay. Uh, and I I know how to make like basically anything that has to do with beads, like beading ear, beaded jewelry, earrings, and uh, different necklaces and mm -hmm. just. Tons of stuff like that, and that's how I learned to to bead and uh, do work with clay. Or maybe tomorrow you can make some beaded jewelry or something. I can. That'll be fun. Yeah, I can. We can actually both do jewelry because I can work on my hoops, and then you can work on that. Or if it's not tomorrow, it's one day. Yeah. That'll be something to add it. Because he makes some really good jewelry, y'all. He has made so much jewelry for me over the years. He would just surprise me with stuff and like Mother's Day gifts for family. Okay, let's see. Market bags will be pretty. Ooh, so you think market bags will be okay with acrylic yarn? Because I've been wanting to make a market bag with acrylic yarn, but a lot of people say it's better to make it with the cotton yarn. Is it just my stripe? Yes. Oh, you love this net hands? Yes. I love it. This is the color cherry. I believe Barbara was asking what the colors are. This one is called um, Wild Blueberry. Okay, so Joe, if you get to where you want to sell your yarn bowls on Etsy, they range from a price of 20 to 200 Whoa, Jennifer, really? You said, Woo, wow, it's raining so hard right now. It's triggered my cameras. What? Oh my goodness. Wow. I don't know if everybody's family with Jax as well. Jax is an awesome channel. For no anybody who knows Jax or her channel's creation by Jax here. Um, I don't know, Jax, if you want to put your link up. Um, but yeah, she has a great channel and she's doing a crochet long. I have my yarn, I think it's in the basement though. I bought puzzle yarn. Jax has done an um, awesome hooded shawl or, you know, hooded shawl. And it's really, with pockets, really gorgeous. 
And um, I'm using mine with puzzle yarn. I'm using the puzzle that she used. She's like a tannish colored puzzle yarn. My first time ever doing it. So, so hey, Joe, can you make an earring holder to display the y'all's jewelry? What? See, now, you, Lori, you got some great ideas. I love that. That'd be awesome, too. You know what I mean? Like an earring holder? Oh, yeah. Something to display jewelry with. I've been need. Oh, my goodness. Babe, baby, baby. Mm -hmm. I just thought of a crazy idea. Oh, yeah. He's over here. I wish I could see what he's doing, but I'm, not, I'm just going to wait, y'all. I never saw him do this before, y'all. I'm super I'm super excited. I'm super proud. Oh, yeah. He's doing good. Yeah. Hook holder. Wow. Hook holders. Earring holders. How do you make twisted headbands ear warmers? Pretty up to tour. Yes, I love, Sandra, I love the Twisted Ear Warmers. I make so many of those. I love them. I am addicted to those, y'all. Seriously. Sean, can you bring up a, can you bring up my bag real quick? Yes, just awake again. Oh, my goodness. Thank you so much. Chauncey, can you go bring me a bag of whips? Hmm? I bring a bag of, a, not whips, but projects right there next to the uh, Total Gym. That bag right next to the Total Gym. Bring it up here. Please. Are you waiting? Are you waiting? Right quick, please. Okay, it's a sunset hook wrap with pockets. Okay, there it goes. Jax has her link again, guys. It's called a sunset hooded wrap with pockets, y'all. And um, guys, y'all gonna love this pattern. She releases it every Friday. And I haven't looked at it yet because I, I haven't had a chance to do it. Because um, I know it's gonna make me want to do it and I can't do it right now. For my birthday, my parents got me a yarn bowl from Etsy. It was one hundred fifty. What? But I mean, was it a larger size? Was it because of the type? I wonder what what made it that much. Was it just? I'm I'm thinking maybe size. I don't know. So I just finished a pink and black marker. You just finished it? What? Lana, that was that quick or what? That seems quick. You hear that? Lana finished that already. Wow. So she just started. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. It's like you start. Did you just start that? Well, I guess you, when did you start that? I don't even know when you started. Did you start it? Were you kind of having them done going at the same time? Granny's showing some love. Granny's saying, hey. So, yeah, I got this one done, guys. This is going to be nice scrubby, y'all. Honestly, this is going to be nice. I like the way it feels. I'm not sure it's going to be on dishes, but I feel like it will be great on a face, on skin. I feel like this will be really nice on skin, guys. So, I'm going to have plenty of these made up. I have a couple displays. I'm going to really build my table up. I'm like, I'm going to build my, I don't know, well, I guess I have to figure out how much space I have. I didn't even think I even read my email. <laughs> I'll probably have like a 10 by 10 because I wanted to make it like a pretty little walkthrough. I got to bring my canopy there, my tables, have them nicely um, with a nice nice tablecloths on them. Um, and I want to build my tables up so people can like, oh my goodness, what's over there? I'm ready, y'all. I'm super kind of nervous. Um, my daughter's going to be modeling some stuff. I'm going to be modeling some stuff. Um, I might try to get my husband and my sons to model some stuff if I can get them something summer friendly because I don't want them to be out there sweating. <laughs> I don't want them to be out there sweating, y'all. My my son and my husband's my son my son and my husband's my husband and my sons they all have long hair so I'm thinking about making even I make them some little Rasta tams just to wear to take pictures in and they can take them off let them sweat for like two seconds and I'll take them off. He says it's one of a kind with a goofy face holds two cakes. Oh, really? Wow. Whole suitcase and a little... Oh, it's like one of those kind with the little yarn that comes out of the nose and stuff. D, you are the strange font again. Oh, yes. Granny D loves that font. I love that mm. font. I like how that is. I always wanted to try to find a different font myself. But I like Granny found a way to do it. Because I tried to get one, but it would only work certain times. It wouldn't work like, like how Granny D is doing it on, on YouTube. It won't work for me here. It will only work like if I was sending a text or something. So I like how she can do that everywhere. I like that. Yeah, I love that fine. I love Granny D. Like, what was Joe saying the other day? Granny, Joe was like, Granny has some spunk. <laughs> what was he just saying that the other day? Mm -hmm. He was like, that's amazing. She has some spunk. Yeah. He said, thanks, Heather. Yeah. He said, yes. Yarn comes out of the nose. Yes. I was seeing some of those things. I think that was before I even knew what they were. And I was like, what is this? But that was before I was really, you know. I wasn't new to crocheting, but I wasn't new to, I wasn't um, into bowls. I really wasn't into bowls like that. I'm getting into stuff a little late. People are like, oh, you <laughs> like I'm, certain things I'm getting into really late because you a water I didn't, you know, a I didn't water. know if I was yeah, going to use sweet. them or not. So I didn't really know, should I get this? Am I going to use it? Do I really care about it? And now I'm like, oh, okay, I can use all this now. I'm going to do it. 
I'm doing like a lot of trying here right now. Okay. Sounds good to me. I gotta work on it. Have some fun. I gotta do some trial and error ordeal type of stuff because I think my base is too small. So when I made, and then my base is too small, then I made my coils too little. Do you want to put this on here, babe? Let's see. One of these. Let's see. Is that or what? No, because the bowl, baby, got to build up. The base ain't going to be as big as the bowl is. Oh, I thought you were talking about at least the bottom of this. This is going to sit about, I don't know. That's what I I'm sorry. I'm confused. No, no, baby. The bowl builds up, so it's going to be room in the bowl. You oh, okay. Yeah, I see what you're saying. Okay. don't go like this. Oh, okay. I see what you're saying. You know what I'm saying? That's crazy. That's why I'm going to try to build it that way. So, unless you want it all just one straight up. Oh, my goodness. Wow, I need it right now. I got my ink pens right here. Unless Thank you. Unless you just want to go straight up, I'm not sure. No, no, no. I don't want it straight up. I want you how you're doing it, honey. I don't want it just like you're doing it. Okay, I got to write these ideas down. Y'all are dropping down ideas like I have no idea, and I got to get these out. I got to write them all down, y'all, because I will forget all this. One bad thing is I don't need everything I have to no clay. Oh, you better play some clay chicken. Oh, no, yeah. Ain't, ain't yeah, you know. So what you want to do then? You can make something else then, honey. I got another small block of white over here. Yeah, don't worry about it then, honey. Just make anything you want. Then. Let me just play a little bit. Or see. can you make like a, what about a little tube or something with the whole hook's in or something, maybe? I'll just play for a minute. So okay. Whatever. Okay, let's see. You say here, just listening. Okay, Danny. Okay, you said, display your scrub is like a bowl of fruit. That's going to be so good. My phone is about to run out of juice. Okay, Julie, thank you for hanging out. I appreciate you. Love you so much. Blessings. Sweet sleep tight. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Hugs and kisses. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Okay, display scrubbies. All right. Y'all got some great ideas, y'all. I am a little nervous. I'm going to do a live, though, while I'm there. I'm a little nervous, so I'm going to be honest, y'all. Like a bowl of fruit. Yeah, I'm going to make sure, make sure she's... Make sure our nervousness go down. I'm gonna help you out a lot. I appreciate you, honey. I'm, ex I'm excited though, y'all. It's gonna be the biggest thing I ever did. That night, Julie. It's gonna be the biggest thing I'm, right now. I'm gonna be like my normal quiet self. So I got so much stuff, guys, I've been doing. And um, I got some older stuff. I, I, might, I think I might try, you know. To talk a little more because I'm usually so quiet and stuff. I usually don't say very much. I always try to, you know. Yeah, he's going to be quiet, guys. When is it? It's August 15th. So I roll the scrubbies and put them in the holes of a Keurig pod covers. Of towers. Why did I say Keurig? What? Ooh, I love that tower. I love that uh, that tower. That's going to be gorgeous. That'll be gorgeous. You're right, Jax. Thank you. Yeah, it's August 15th. So I'm going to be trying to go get Different things that display stuff in, build up. I like the little crate things. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna be like just going to price some stuff, looking at different things, and slowly but surely getting that stuff and working at the same time. Cause I, I want to have a nice display, you know. And I gotta get a metal thing to hang my clothing on because every time I get a clothing rack, I get plastic, and the wind picks up and it just drops on the ground. My husband calls it sweet water because it falls over simple. I mean, really simply. I mean, really easily. <laughs> He goes sweet water. He's like, oh yeah, that's sweet water. It's falling over. That's sweet water right there. <laughs> I don't know. I never heard of sweet water, but it's. <laughs> I guess when something's easy to fall, or I guess it's weak. I guess it's sweet water. <laughs> yeah, that's what my mom said. Oh my goodness. So yes, use a Keurig. Okay. Hold on. And Jax, are you feeling better? I see you hanging out tonight. I appreciate you. Are you feeling better with your headaches and things like that? I'm so glad you are here for scrubbies. I like the idea of scrubbies. So we can use either scrubbies. I even make popsicle makers. All that stuff can be there. Popsicle holders. I got this cute little Percy purse. I think this is going to be adorable. A little cute little mermaid bag with the little straps on it. I think that'll be adorable. You know, come on. I kind of want to be twisted right now, but it's all good. I did this with the um, Red Heart Super Saver Stripes. He said, hey, the only sweet water I've heard of is Sweetwater May. <laughs> Heather said the only sweet water she ever heard of was <laughs> Sweetwater May. <laughs> uh, speaking of Maine, I would love to go there for their seafood. Anyways, okay. 
Thank you so much. I guess finally, but still really tired. Okay, so you got a little drain to see you. But like I said, if you gotta get your rest, get you some rest. Don't, don't, don't strain. Thank y'all so much. You said, Damon, how long have you and Joe been together? Or I'll come pop. Um, yes, we have been together for how long, honey? Twenty-two years. I like to. I like to. Uh, act. I like nah, to. we've been together. We'll be be together sixteen years this year. Yeah, it'll be sixteen years this year, guys. In December. And our anniversary is next week, guys. We'll be married eight years next week. Wow, guys, can I believe this? What day is that, honey? I mean, son. Twenty third. Tuesday? Where's your eyesight at? Nothing. What, what day is the 23rd? Is it Tuesday, next Tuesday? What day is the 23rd? 23rd is next Saturday. No it's next Tuesday. I already know it. Yes, it is. It's next Wednesday. Man, why is he guys? When is my thing for school? Oh, my gosh. When is my thing for school? Mm. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. What is it? Next Wednesday or Tuesday? Tuesday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Tuesday. Next Tuesday, guys. A week from today, guys. Our anniversary of being together for eight years, guys. Can y'all believe it? Thank you so much, Chit Jack Queen. Yes, we've been together 16 years, y'all. And I appreciate that y'all saying that we compliment each other well. Thank you. I appreciate you so much. We, Thank you. We have learned so much from each other and all that good stuff. Is God my... has been so good to us over the yes, years. Yes, he has. And it we was... still love each other. Yes, after... After all these years, I miss her when I go to the store. Oh, that's sweet. Yeah, I'm definitely missing when he goes to the store. I'm like, come on, how long does they get here? <laughs> <laughs> My tip, use solid white table covers. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Busy prints, okay, so you just use like solid white, cool. That's pretty dead. And guess what? I'm going to try to get me a banner, y'all, with the with uh, with my logo on there. And some card. I'm going to get some business cards as well. Thank you so much, Shit Jack Queen. Yeah, that is a great tip, isn't it? Make some washcloths and roll them up with, in a bowl too. Sell them for two for whatever. Oh my goodness, yes. Oh Lord, you y'all so sweet. I'm loving this, y'all. Y'all are just blessing me. Oh, what a beautiful blessing you both are from one. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you so much, clumsy mumsy, clumsy mumsy. I don't want to say clumsy mumsy. I'm using a better saying with names, but as I truly appreciate you. Joe says the 23rd is when it is. <laughs> Happy anniversary a little early. Thank you so much. Thank yes, you. next Tuesday. Yep. So, Dana, did you take the eight years to ask? Did, did it take you eight years to ask? <laughs> or, Dana? Oh, well, no, it didn't take us eight years to ask. We were just wanting to let it be a good wedding to where it was going to be. I wanted her to have I wanted her to have her perfect wedding. Yep, that's what he wanted. There we go. And when I was able to do that, I did. Mm -hmm. Well, can I have back my $30,000 now? It's over uh, thirty. Can I have back one? That's 30? that's with the memories, and that's a part of the memory. So that way, it makes you memory. Make I don't you think have of. a car now. <laughs> that, it makes you. Back. It makes you remember the good good times. Can and I stuff. have back a piece of it? To know. But it was great, y'all. I'm telling you, we had a great wedding, y'all. Oh, uh, hey, Tasha's in the building. How you doing? Hello, welcome in. Love you, sis. Thank you for the thumbs up. How you feeling tonight? What you got going on? You just enjoying your night relaxing? So I just watched a chicken video. Oh, wow. Thank you so much, Clumsy Mumsy. He said, needs to go to bed. Okay, good night. Jennifer, thank you for hanging out. Appreciate you. I hope you come back again. Truly appreciate you. Thank you. He said, 30,000 gone. I know, Tasha. Tell me about it. I was married for 30 years. I miss having that bond. Oh, yes. I know what you're saying, Christy. It's an awesome bond. Definitely. He said, it's gone. Yeah. Try to say, nope. Sorry, Joe's gone. There we go. Can't get it back. <laughs> Where's the OMG, Joe? You got me giggling. <laughs> I can't get a dollar back. Oh. One dollar. Oh, my goodness. So, no, you can't get a dollar back. But I like it because, guys, they got a drawstring to it. I made a drawstring here. So I can open up and it can fit, you know, all kinds of goodies in there for the little, the little one in your life. And then I can draw it up, flip it over. I'm gonna probably, I'm probably gonna put a little button there. And I did, like I said, it's nice and wide. Little shell stitch there, and it got a little tail, a little mermaid fin. Oh my goodness, what? Chelsea loves us 20 years in August. That's so amazing. Look, Barbara says you're investing now, Joe. Yeah. You're investing now. You in there? I got this little cute little cardigan I did. A little young girly cardigan, baby girl cardigan. 
It was like a little crop cardigan, though. You know, it's kind of like one of those little shrugs, but it's a cardigan. I made this with um, True Blue Ombre. And look at that beautiful shell. Look at that in the back, y'all. Look at the pattern on the back. It's kind of like a little shell stitch. It's a, a V stitch. Is it a V stitch? Like a V shell stitch, if I can see it. I love this, too, y'all. Came out really, really nice. So I'm going to just have a lot of different things to offer. But I want to put some stuff on a, um, like I said, a, a metal rack. Because I'm telling you, those <laughs> those plastic wraps are like, no, no. Thank y'all so much. Thank y'all. Yes. Thank y'all for the love. Is that me and him were both very crafty. What? He did woodwork and made amazing things. We crafted together all the time. Oh, my goodness. Wow, that's amazing. Yeah, I know about that crafting together. Okay, Jax. Yeah, me and this guy right here, we always do a lot of crafting. and You know, he's a bowler. That's where his true love is at and everything. And he loves cooking as well, but we do, like I said, whatever each other likes. We, You know, he tries some different things. I can get him to crochet. He tried to give me the bowl, but I suck too much, and so I can't do it. <laughs> but he doesn't mind, though, because he doesn't mind. You don't mind a king bowl, right? Mm -mm. I, like, I like the fact that you're, more, you're better chili than you is yeah. bowler, because actually, she actually, seriously, guy, when, she, when tournament time comes, like, she get the other team out of their game so crazily, guys. She be... She talks to the other team, and they just be totally out of their game. <laughs> I've had some of my friends be like, would you please not bring your wife next week? Jesus Christ. <laughs> she talks to us out of our game so crazily. Gee, you got a six-man. That's not fair. Wow. I mean, they just be kidding, but they just be like, really like, wow, how she's so into us winning. Yeah, I am. And, we, and not to brag a lot, thank God for it, we win a lot. Yeah. I have a really great team. Wow, yeah, he do, he does. Okay, because he's been married for 52 years. That's amazing. Heather's got 19 Dece December. Everybody's got some beautiful years of marriage. I can't wait till we get there. Like I said, I can't wait. But I'm I just, can't I'm, wait till we get there. Yeah, like I love, I love accumulating mm -hmm. years with this guy. I do. I love it. And you said that fried chicken, Joe. Dang, stuff look good. Granny said it looks good. Thank you. Yes, you said you will get there. Yes, thank y'all so much. And I made this awesome shrug as well. I love this one. I did this with baby yarn, guys. It's a shrug. It's kind of hard to see. Because this right here kind of cuffs up over the... um. This cuffs up. There's no arms, okay? I wish I had a mannequin. Ooh. You know what, babe? I huh? really wish I had some real clay. Like, no, not like a no big, offense. Like a lot of I don't, or no, some of that brown clay from the ground. I need some good clay that I can work with easily. Does like. any of y'all grow clay? Or does clay <laughs> form in anybody's backyard? We can come dig up a bucket full. <laughs> Uh -huh. I need to get some of that stuff that softens it. Mm, oh, I don't yeah. care how much you mold this in your hand. You need to be soft. It needs to be soft, soften. Yeah, this is called a cotton candy shrug. This is a free pattern, and you make it with baby yarn, and this kind of cuffs over like a collar. And you got your sleeves, and it's really cute, y'all. I may have to shell stitch. Mm -hmm. I really may have to do what uh, somebody said. Can I make a mold? Mm -hmm. I might have to try to play with making a mold. Oh, like around a bowl or take something it like that. Off because. Mm -hmm. Like, see how this is? See the syringe? Mm -hmm. I see that's forming good. But it's going to take so much work mm -hmm. to Get the person smooth like it out. Oh, that's nice. It's smooth. That's good, too. But it's going to take a bunch of work yeah. for each layer like this to smooth it out because mm -hmm. it's so hard. The clay is not hard, but it's it's just I was trying to see my hands because if I could work it a little bit with some water and a sponge. Yeah. It's a little better on it. You see, like it's working a little bit? A little better. You say, yes, I was watching that fried chicken video, and I'm was, and i fasting. Oh, snap. Who fasting? <laughs> and Tasha is like, oh, I was like, God, sorry. can I have one piece, please? Oh, oh man, Tasha, I am so sorry. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Sorry, y'all. He said, got to go to Georgia for clay and red clay. I know. Oh, man, who lives in Georgia? We got to go visit. I hate when people, I hate when I'm fasting, and my mom... My, like my mom ain't fasting or something, and she be like, "Oh yeah, I just made some catfish," and I'm like, "Mom, I'm fasting, like, <laughs> mom." Tasha, how long you fasting for? That's amazing. That's great that you are fasting. That's good. <laughs> Heather said, "Why did you tempt yourself like that?" <laughs> and Joe wants to wants it to feel like butter. <laughs> yes, he does, doesn't he? He said, I'm in Florida from New England. Where's everyone from? All right, so come see mommy's asking where everybody's from. I am in Indiana. Heather says, Karen. Oh, Karen is? 
And I love me some Karen. Oh, I'm gonna go visit Karen. Pop up. Doop, doop. <laughs> oh my goodness. Granny's going to sleep tonight, Granny. Love you. Sleep tight. Thank you for being here. Appreciate you so much. Okay, she's fast for two days. Okay, that's good. That's great. So, yes, Heather said she's from she's from Florida. She lives in Florida. Like me, I'm from Indiana. I still live in Indiana. Everybody gonna drop your time? Where y'all from? Good night, Granny. Sleep tight. Love you. Hugs and kisses. Don't let the bed buzz bite. Blessings. I like to say this to everybody go to sleep. You're in, okay. And since Carla is in Virginia, I was going to say, since Virginia is in Carla. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I got that one thing. Uh, everybody's showing where they're from. Everybody's showing some love. Have you ever done pottery on the wheel? Yes. Yes, he has. And I had a great teacher by the name of Paul Munich. Okay. Taught me how to work on the wheel. Great guy. I tried to look him up everywhere. I can't find him nowhere. Wow. You got you looked him up recently? Yeah, I tried to look him up everywhere. Oh, man. I can't remember if Maybe I was spelling his name right. Oh, uh, this was like M U E? Yeah. M I N? M U N I C H? Yeah, M U N I C H. That's how I first spelled it. Mm. I don't know. I don't know. I couldn't think of too many ways to spell me. No, it don't sound like it's not too many. I made this beanie, guys. It's like a little different stitch, y'all. Really different stitch. It's kind of like really weird and different. I like different stitch type of hats, guys. So I just want to play with it. And then I turned it inside out. It's even kind of weirder. A little more texture. It's kind of different, though. I'm going to get a pom-pom. Make some pom-poms on there. Yeah, okay. So, all right. Sherelle says, from Southern California. You said, whenever I'm fasting that when <laughs> that's when all the good food come around. Oh my goodness. It always happens like that, doesn't it? Yeah. Beautiful work. She said, I'm from I'm in California. Okay, everybody show some love. Saying Sasha when fasting, all food looks good. I know. Barbara's in Mississippi. Laura's in Piscataway. Pis Piscataway? Pisca what's Pisca? Okay. Piscataway, New Jersey. And it's 147 here. Oh, is it? Yeah, yes it is. Because we're on the East Coast. Interesting looking hat. Oh, thank you. Yeah, it's a different stitch. It's a different stitch. Um, This is the way it's supposed to be right here. This way. It's like a different little, you know, it's a different little uh, stitch I got from a pattern. I was trying to find something different, a little something different to make. I was like, let me find something different. Something to work on. You know, I got some little messy bun beanies. I'm like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put all kinds of different stuff out. I don't know if the messy bun beanies are still in style, but guess what? I'm still gonna make them. Hey, Vivian, what you doing up, Vivian? Are you hanging out? How are you doing tonight? How you feeling? What's going on over there? Okay, let's see what everybody's saying. Um, Tasha said, I'm in Rhode Island, Mass now. Okay, so Tasha's in Rhode Island, Mass. Isn't that crazy that a name of a state is actually a city name too? That's amazing. Okay, you said I love myself a good beanie. Oh, really, Tasha? Oh, well, yes, Tasha. I got your address for Happy Meal, so you probably be getting you something to model in one of your videos. Tasha definitely does awesome videos, and if you're not a part of her family, guys, she does great reviews. So if you have a channel or something like that, you want to review, get her, get you out there more to different people. She is really good at that. She will send business your way, guys. So yeah, this is like a little cute little messy bun. You put your ponytail out, you know. The part of that, what part of Mississippi you live in? Oh my goodness, so Vivian lives in Mississippi too, so that's amazing. Amazing when you can find people that live close, you know, or live in the same state as you. You never know if y'all can go sh yarn shopping together, crafting together, you never know. And this is a cow that I did, y'all. This is like one of my favorite cows I did. A knitted cow right here, you know. Let me see if I can find it. Okay. Yeah, this is one of my favorites, guys. I'm going to be honest. He said, just sent you a pic of the Cardi Messenger, and I have to go to bed. Okay. Sleep tight. Thank you so much. And she's from Columbia, British Cumberland. I don't know if you're here or not. Lana, do you want me to show everybody the pictures of your Cardi? Or do you just want me to keep it to myself? Because I don't want to be, you know. You let me know, Lana. But sleep tight. Love you, Lana. <laughs> Hugs and kisses. Don't let the bed buzz bite. Thank you for joining. I appreciate you. Okay, so you're close to Tupelo. Okay. Or Tupelo, I'm not sure. Tupelo. That's Tupelo? Mm -hmm. How you know? Mm -hmm. Oh, never mind. He knows. You, you got family out Tupelo? Very 
Oh, he got family down super low, y'all. You yeah, said, yep, I'm stuff. here all alone in California. No, you don't hear it. Chelsea loves in California. He said, yes, Dana, I'm up just setting, settling down, been making here. What? I'm talking about Vivian's over there making some earrings. That's amazing. I got so many earrings I got to make up too, and I got to send out. I got mostly all my earrings I got to send out. I think I have them done. I just have to get my earrings that I want to make up for selling. I have to get those done. So you live in Holly Springs. Okay. So yeah, this is one of my favorites right here, guys. This cow, I love it, y'all. This cow's amazing. This is what you call a knitted, a knitted cow, and I love the stitching on it, as you can see. Gorgeous. I made this with, um, what is this called, babe? What kind of yarn is this, honey? <laughs> Red heart, super same. Y'all should have seen his face. I said, what kind of yarn is this, honey? He said, <laughs> what is the face, babe? I said, what kind of yarn is this? What do you do, babe? <laughs> oh, my God. He said, yeah, is that a cow? Yes, it's a cow. You know I love my cows, y'all. Do I call them cows? Why are they moving? Because that's not that kind of cow. It's a cow. I love it, y'all. This is my favorite. You keep saying it's not that kind that's of cow. That's a cow or something, Nick. I don't know what I said. It's a cow. Okay, yes. And Jax is from Cali. So, yeah, we got some Cali's. We got some Cali's. Nashville, Tennessee. Over 50 years now. What? That's amazing. Elvis Presley hometown. What? So I don't even know where Granny's at. I wish Granny was still here. Does anybody know where Granny lives in? What state Granny lives in? I don't know if I want to say she's in Kentucky or North Carolina or something. I don't know where she's at. But I love this. Love that. Came out pretty well. Um, what else I got? I can show. Um, it's so far away, guys, so forgive me. I'm trying to get close. I'm trying to get close to these goodies over here. Let's see. I love making cows and wearing them. You asked me to. I definitely love my cows. You said, okay. It's not so far. Oh, really? Granny is in South Carolina. Oh, okay, that's where she's at. She's in SC. Okay, I never knew where she was at. I was wondering where she was at. So I got this shawl as well. It's like a little light shawl, though. But it could be more of a triangle scarf, I'm thinking. Because it's so small. It's not really big. I kind of got tired of doing it. It's one of those shawls you basically just... I guess all sh shawls... Another whip. No, just, I'm done with this. I made it. It's not a shawl. It's a, yes, it's a triangle. She said a couple of things. It's a triangle. Uh, it's a whip. It's, no, it's a triangle. It's a triangle. It's a whip. It's a triangle scarf, though. Seriously. Well, it's, it's, it's a, a virus shawl, y'all. And I made it into a triangle scarf because I didn't feel like doing it anymore. I think I ran out of yarn. I think I ran out of yarn for it. You said the stripes is pretty. Thank you so much, Barbara. It's um, calming stripe from Red Heart. So this is a, um, oh, this is crazy right here. I don't think I ever put this on, y'all. I might take a picture of this. This is a virus shawl, guys. It was going around really popular. I just don't want nobody virus. Is it north? Is what north? Where I'm at? Oh, somebody else is north. Oh, okay. Thank you so much. Yeah, so I'm loving this, y'all. And uh, I don't really do a lot of yellow or anything, but this yellow is nice. This yellow is nice, y'all. I'm loving this. But it's a virus shawl. I did it with... Um, Hey, cuz, how you doing? Everybody, this is my cousin, Tamika Reed. is my first cousin, guys. She is in here showing some love, guys. Hello, show some love, y'all. Show my family some love. So this is gorgeous, guys. Look at this. Look how this came out. I, um, I really got this, and I'm, I mean, I, I don't know. I didn't think I would like it like that, but I like this. I usually, this is my daughter's favorite color, y'all. She would wear this all the time. She would wear this like all the time. I'm surprised she didn't steal it. Like, I'm surprised she didn't, I'm surprised she didn't steal it. Because she loves this. And she modeled this for me on Instagram, guys. So, um, she modeled this for me on Instagram. But, um, she never really stole it or anything. <laughs> Everybody showing some love to cuz. Thank y'all so much. I got another messy bun beanie here, guys. I'm going to get all this stuff displayed. I fell in love. One of my friends, um, made this colorway. And I fell in love with the way she did it. So I was like, ooh, I'm going to, you know, use that pattern that she did. You love the yellow? Oh, thank y'all so much. Thank you so much. So I'm a beginner in crochet. Is that virus shawl hard to make? It looks great on you. Oh, thank you. And love the cousin. You say, how y'all been? Oh, my goodness. We have been so great. Just having a good time with life. No, I'm just kidding. We have been having a good time with life. But we've been up to nothing much. Just working. How about you, cuz? How you been doing? I see you've been doing pretty good. I see you've been doing great. 
He said, hello, how's the family? How are the kids? He said, hello, Joe True. Yeah, he said, you can make really simple, really small triangle shawl, then whip stitch the Oh, corners. Oh, yes, make a kerchief. Sounds amazing, Lori. He said, guys, I love it. Love when Dana says, guys. I know. Yeah, as y'all know, Nana's hands always talks about me because I say guys a lot. Okay, so I'm gonna say, hey guys, welcome on in. Hello, come on in. I'm gonna say, oh my gosh, guys, thank y'all so much, guys. I appreciate <laughs> you guys, guys. I don't mean, I don't understand. Y'all know how much y'all mean to me, guys. Thank y'all for hitting a thumbs up, guys. Guys, thank y'all for coming in and hitting the subscribe button, guys. I say guys a lot. Maybe somebody could ever screen record me, make a little edited video, and be like, guys, 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 guys. Welcome, guys. Welcome, guys. Hit the thumbs, guys, guys, guys. Okay, but anyway, sorry. Fiber Hearts are here. Hello, welcome, welcome, welcome. Karen and Brian, welcome in. How y'all feeling tonight? I bet it's probably about nine o'clock in California right now. I'm just kidding. It's two o'clock here, so that means it's what? What? No, two o'clock here, so it's what do I want to say? Eleven? Twelve? One? Two? Okay, about eleven. Yeah, eleven o'clock. Going on eleven. Three minutes to eleven or so. So that's good to hear. But lol, I am her daughter. Me. I am her daughter. Me and my mom have the same YouTube channel. Oh. What? Hey, little cuz. That's little cuz. Y'all get out of here. This is little cuz. What? Yes, little Tamika. Yes, they both have the same name. You got little Tamika, big Tamika. What? Oh my goodness. Thank you for coming in and showing some love. How sweet. I appreciate you. So, you have a YouTube channel? You have content on your channel? I definitely better come and subscribe and show you some love. Wow, look at the little cousins coming in and show some love. That's amazing. Thank you. Okay, so everybody's 11. Look at y'all over in Cali. Y'all talking about 11. 11. <laughs> everybody's in California on the ball. Yes. So, yeah, this is not. This poncho, I mean, this shawl. I made this a little bit closer to my beginning stage. I'm going to be honest. I made this, like, seriously. I wasn't really, um, well, I guess it wasn't beginning, but this is my first shawl. So, when you make something your first time, it wasn't too bad for my first shawl. I'm going to be honest. Like I said, I'm making this into a triangle shawl, probably a triangle scarf. You're so welcome. You say, hey, Christy, love that shawl. Thank you so much. Just I'm going to call it a night. Okay, yes, Lord, we're going to call it a night in probably about 15 minutes. So I'm just showing a couple things I'm going to be showing for this craft here, guys. You said, make a TikTok. Oh, my goodness, me make a TikTok? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I don't know if I'm going to make a TikTok. <laughs> I'm trying to get your look. It might be more clear. I can build up. You want to show them what you got going so far or no? No. Okay. Like, okay, I just want you to start your beginning stage. You don't want, you don't have to. All right, guys, this is Joe's beginning stage of. I haven't done anything, guys. I haven't mo. I haven't like did anything. Ain't nothing here. You take it, grab it. Okay, I didn't know if you want. To... And nothing is there. I just. Yeah, he just basically have his base going. Guys. I just got my base going. We don't have enough clay, guys. Oh, this is beautiful. I was trying to see something. I gotta find somebody who lives in Georgia so I can get me some clay. I'm gonna dig up in their backyard. <laughs> We're gonna dig up in their backyard see if they can listen to some clay. See, that was a vineyard shawl. Now I'm working on my apple orchard. Yeah. If y'all don't know Chrissy, if y'all not in her family, guys, hook me hook me up, crochet with Chrissy, guys. She has an awesome channel. She makes so many beautiful yeah, garments. And it seems like she makes like one I'm, or two items a day. I mean, she is really productive, guys. I'm telling you. She is very productive. She uses her day very well. I need to learn from her. She will have shawls made up, blankets made up, just gorgeous. I mean, oh, she, oh, water her yarn choice is just beautiful, y'all. Y'all gonna love her yarn choice. You said, let us see. Hello. Okay, yeah, we've seen, we seen it. Okay, so like I said, I recommend doing this viral shawl. Check my email. Check my email. Okay, check it right now. Okay, I'm checking it. All right, I'm checking my email right now. $10 to use my phone. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Okay, I'll give you $10. $10 worth of kisses. Oh, I can turn this off too. I don't even use that bag. I'll turn the hot spot off. Okay, that's right now. Oh, sorry, it goes off on its own. That's good. Okay, he says, I have no life. Uh-uh, I'm not saying it like that. Oh, why you got clay on your... Oh, my goodness, I got it on my finger now. Clay on the back of your phone, too. No, Christy, I'm not saying you have no life. I'm just saying you're using up your day in a good way. Because, I mean, I could probably be doing the same thing, but I get caught up on... Getting on Instagram and Facebook and everything else and scrolling. 
Anyways, just ignore this guy over here in the corner. She got scroll itis. <laughs> I got, uh, he said I got scroll itis. He said you have 1.5 script. Yes, what I'm talking about. Yes, Karen, that's gonna be amazing. I can't wait to see how it comes out. I'm super excited. You see, y'all run, y'all are champs. You're still running, guys. Yeah, we still running zigzag. We're gonna be done in about 10 minutes though. You said, Danny, can jo can Joe sing one song right before singing uh, signing off? Yes. Yeah. The enemy has been busy, but he is defeated. Yes, going to be on a high spiritual note. The anointing breaks us. Yo, yes, yes, yes. You're so right. I love that. You're right. You gonna you wanna sing something, huh? We... Well, you want me to sing, baby? I don't care. <clears throat> oh my goodness. So Samika says her birthday is next month. Okay, so how old are you gonna be next month? Look at that, y'all. These are the earrings that Vivian made, guys. I never seen anybody make earrings like this. I'm sorry, Vivian. Is it okay if I show these? Oopsie. I'm just putting all your business out there. I didn't know that you... Sorry. Is it okay if I show this? I'm sorry, guys. I already showed it already, so I might as well keep showing it. Vivian, please don't be mad at me. I'm very... I, these are making me really happy, though. I know you guys can't see them, but they're elephants, guys. You can't really see them, guys. I believe they're elephants. Yes, they're elephants. And they're, they're super gorgeous, guys. I don't know what's going to happen, but these are gorgeous. Wow, that is amazing. And so, you said you have a channel, Tamika, right? Do you have videos or you just do more TikToks on your videos or what kind of stuff are you doing? Okay, let's see. What we got going on? Um let's see. Hey, hook me up, hook me up. Okay, everybody show some love. Oh, Vivian says, Joe, I enjoyed your chicken. Thank you. Thank you so much. She said, no, I'm not saying it. LOL. You're not saying it? Who? Uh, okay. No, that was Christy. Mm -hmm. Love it. Thank y'all so much. This is Vivian just did a great job, right? She did amazing. Okay, so you got your stuff on your channel. Okay, I'm gonna make sure I subscribe to you. You said elephants. The girl, the girl that was my flower girl, loved them. Really? I know a lot of people love um. A lot of people <laughs> love um elephants, and these are the gorgeous, right? Oh, her baby son just got from out of nowhere. Oh, he was saying, <laughs> oh, I was, would you sleep the whole time, buddy? Yep. Oh, you just woke up, you was up there by yourself. He was like, oh, I'll come down and <laughs> snuggle with somebody. You cool? You and a TikTok. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I'm going to check you out then. I definitely love to support. I'm a big supporter. Your cousin loves to support, so I'm definitely going to be there to support you, okay? And I appreciate you being well, she here. Got a, a TikTok or she got a, a YouTube channel? Yes, YouTube, Q, and a TikTok. Oh, Yes. Okay, so yeah, why are you selling something? I am doing a craft fair. I always sell stuff. What's her name? I'll subscribe to her. Okay, Tamika Reed. I'm happy I'm going to be fourth grade. Yes, you're going to fourth grade. Congratulations. I'm so happy for you, too. Your cousin, little Tamika. Oh, yes, Jason. Jay, oh, Jay Sleep. Yeah, Jason lies, you know, because they always went to Boys and Girls Club and stuff with her. Oh, so what's it called? I don't know how to put that in. Exactly. You know what she is, little Tamika. Uh, T-A-M. Your cousin. It's a T-A-M-E-I-K-A. T-A-M-I-K-A. I-K-A. Reed. Ready to read? R-E-I-D. Yeah. There you go. Right there. Boop. This one? Nope. Right there. Yeah. Boop. Yep. Okay, yes, pretty sure her ears are pierced. Oh, okay, really? So, are you saying that you want to get some from Vivian? Are you saying, would you want to order some from Vivian? Heather? She said, what's the Instagram, Miss Dana? Creatively Creative Crochet. Clumsy Mumsy. Everything's Creatively Creative Crochet. Etsy, Facebook. Well, I got, if you go to my, if you go to that fried chicken video, if you want to find my Etsy, you'll see it. The website, all that stuff, you'll see it. Email as well. But it's creative, creative crochet on, in, on Instagram and Facebook too. Probably you said good night, everyone. Okay, good night, sis. Carla, sleep tight. Love you. So I'm happy with my little brother is coming to my school. Oh, that's gonna be so sweet. You're gonna be coming to your school. That's so good. Yes, yes, yes. I'm happy too. So I got ear warmers as well. I think it's gonna be cute though. I don't know if I can fit them on my head though, y'all. Can y'all please do me a favor and. <laughs> Become friends with my little cousin, please. Oh, I can't fit. I can't fit. Good night. Good night, Heather. Sleep tight. 
Okay, guys, so it's over. I can't fit this. It's officially. Mm -mm. I think it's too much hair, right? This hair is too much. Mm -hmm. I was after the party it got shut down, so I just thought I'd come show up. He says his birthday is 25. Okay, let's see. After, okay. I don't believe we've met. June the 25th. Oh, June the 25th? Wow. That's amazing. How old is he going to be? Five or four? Okay. Mm. None of these are working. Okay, can't fit that one either, guys. Let's try I, this one. I think. Gotcha. Yeah. Thank you kindly. Prayers for you all. Thank you so much. Prayers for you all so you get some rest. Sleep tight. I think, I think it might. Love you. Thank you for coming in. Joe's going to sing a song right before we head out, guys. Oh, you're going to be five. Okay, that's good. Joe's going to sing a song before we leave that. What song are you going to sing? Give me a song. Mm. You need some more. Mm. Need some more, y'all? <laughs> Seriously, right now? Go get another skin, baby, so we can get on. <laughs> Not another skin. <laughs> baby. Come here. Help me. Oh, oh. All right, I got it. Okay, thank you. She's gonna have a headache after she takes that off. No, no, no. <laughs> look at Madison. Madison did a look. <laughs> Why you got the eyes on me now? I'm struggling, yo. I think it's a fact. It looks <laughs> good, but will you have a headache when you take it off? <laughs> I'm not gonna have a headache. Thank you. See, look, Vivian, show me some love. Thank you. Vivian, it might be cute, but it might be the headache for her once you get done. I wish I had a little pink punch on right now. Okay, so before we head out, you said having a TikTok party. Oh, okay. You having a TikTok party. Okay, so what you gonna be doing? Everybody gonna be doing TikToking and making different little videos? Can you add me? Yes, I will be adding me. I did. I'm gonna be adding me as soon as I get off here because I can't add while I'm in the middle of the video. You gonna be adding me? You can't add me. <laughs> huh? You said add you or add me? She said, can I add her? Hey, like, can you, you, add her? Want, you said, I'm going to be adding me as soon as I get off. Leave me alone. Every time I get sleepy, I start talking crazy. I'll ignore him. He better sing a song before we get out of here, guys. What you sing? I don't know. I need, not another second. Oh, oh, another no, that's minute. That's too many. Not enough. That's too much. Bro. Another day. That's too much. Lord, I don't know what I'm saying. I'm going to work on it. I'm going to work on it. I'm going to work Okay, give me anything. Let's let's go out. with y'all want a fast song? Y'all want a slow song? He said, I'll be snoring. No CPAP tonight. All right, that's what I'm talking about. Yes, I'm going to be adding you, Tamika. I'm going to be add, following you. I'll subscribe to you. I'll come out on TikTok or anything, but I am on here. I can definitely subscribe mm -hmm. to you on here. Your cousin Joe, he just subscribed to you already, so I'm going to subscribe to Okay, so you want to sing a song before we go? Y'all want mm -hmm. fast? I need you to survive. All right, that's it. That's going to be a good song to leave out with. Oh, this is a fit at first. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting attacked here, y'all. I, I think the yarn shrunk. Okay, guys, Tamika, beautiful work to say. And what is your TikTok name? She's going to uh, add you on there, y'all. TikTok name is Tamika223. Chauncey, can you add your cousin? Tamika223. Your little cousin's going to add you because they got TikToks. I don't TikTok. Wait, but... did, the, did, your, did the yarn shrink? The yarn is, the, the yarn don't make yarn like you sit them on. They don't. Because I don't know why they shrunk up on me, y'all. My neck didn't grow. What is it on? Hmm. Tamika223. T-A-M-I-K-A. -A. Hmm. I don't know what happened to that yarn. 223. This didn't oh. shrink up. This, I mm. mean, the yarn shrunk up. My neck didn't grow. Mm -mm. The, okay, you ready? You ready to sing? <clears throat> I need you. Okay. You need me. All right. We're all a part of God's body. Stand with me. Agree with me. We're all a part of God's body. It is His will that every need be supplied. You are in Pour unto me, I need you to survive.
You are important to me. I need you to survive. <clears throat> I pray for you. You pray for me. I love you. I need you to survive. I won't harm you with words from my mouth. I love you. I need you to survive. It is His will that every need be supplied. You are important to me. I need you to survive. You are important to me. I need you to survive. I pray for you. You pray for me. I love you. I need you to survive. I won't harm you with words from my mouth. I love you. I need you to survive. It is His will that every need be sublime. You are important to me. I need you to survive. You are important to me. I need you to survive. Oh, wow. That was awesome. Awesome, <clears throat> awesome, awesome. Yes, Heather said, looks warm. That was great singing, babe, again. Thank you, thank you so much. Very great singing. Said, dang, girl, Tamika, you have almost 500 followers. What? We are not that popular. Oh. <laughs> wow, well, the one, Tamika over here trying to get some followers. You are, you already on the train over there, Tamika. Great job. I might, I might get it. I just don't have any room on my phone. That's why I don't have TikTok or anything. I don't have any room on my phone, guys. Yes, I need you all to survive. Thank you, Lord. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. We need each other. Like I said, I won't speak hard. I won't, I won't harm you with words out of my mouth. Yes, yes, yes. I won't harm you with words out of my mouth. You are so right. Yes, we need each other to survive, y'all. Yes. Yeah, I'm gonna ruin my phone. My phone is really old and crappy. But I'm going when I get my room room my phone. I'm going to say, can you add me on here so I can talk to y'all? Yeah, I'm gonna add you on here. But your look, one of your cousins, Joseph. Just added you on TikTok. You just added on TikTok? I followed her. Or followed her. I'm sorry. He just followed you. Um, your cousin, big cousin Joe, just or, uh, subscribes you on here. I, when I get off here, I'm going to subscribe to you as well. And then I'm going to get your other cousin subscribed to you too. So yes, I would love to talk to you. Say, so praying for you, Nana. May you rest easy tonight and know that God is in control of all things. Pray, Jesus. Thank you, Mr. John. Yes, 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 yes. Let's all keep each other lifted up in prayer, guys. Let's appreciate you all. I love this time together, y'all. We had a great time tonight, right? Yes, we did. Had a great time tonight. I Joe got to make on some good hooks tonight. Oh, and we got y'all helped me out so much with this different craft fair stuff, guys. Appreciate you all so much for that. Did I put, the, did I put that thing on here? Yeah, all kinds of different blankets and stuff. I got so much stuff, guys. I'm going to be setting all this stuff up. I'm excited about this craft fair, guys. I'm excited. Um, For this poncho, for those who are talking about looks warm, Hope y'all have a blessed day. Yes, you have a blessed day, too. This is one of my patterns that I have on my um, Ravelry page, too, guys. This poncho is really nice. Super simple. Really nice. I love it. It's called a one-day poncho. Super simple, guys. You can make it as long as you want. Um, the looser you crochet, the wider it will be. But it increases. So, yeah, that's a super simple one. Bless you, bless you. Um, those who celebrate the monetization party with us. Uh, what last week, babe? Was that Thursday? Mm -hmm. Was got this free pattern. Those who came last week to the monetization party was given this free unicorn slipper pattern, guys. Blessings, y'all. Blessings, blessings. Sleep tight, y'all. You were given this pattern if you were in the monetization party. So thank you for those who were able to came out to the monetization party. Got these awesome unicorn slipper pattern. 
It can be a universal slipper pattern. You can do anything you want with it. So, yeah. I'll probably be sharing with y'all a couple more other things. This pattern is also in my um, Ravelry. It's a little ear warmer. Like this little look. We're up to the side. How are we going to wear it? Well, I guess it can be. I don't know. My daughter my daughter wears these way better than me, but whatever. <laughs> my daughter wears these a lot better than me. Okay, so I told my girls about the unicorn slipper, and they were excited. Really? Oh, yeah. Thank you so much. I appreciate that, Heather. Thank you. Okay, so I guess we're about done, guys. We're going to let y'all get out of here. I'm going to let you guys get out of here, guys, okay? Um, I, know, I hate to let you guys go, but I know it's late. You ready to say good night, honey? Yes, Okay, guys. You said good night, everyone. Although I am not going to bed. Yeah, I'm not. We're not going to go to bed either. We'll get ready to go get a little grubby grub. So I appreciate you all for being here. Another awesome Monday night. Well, now it's Tuesday morning. Love you guys. And tomorrow we'll be making some other things. All right, having a little fun. So if you all can come back tomorrow, we appreciate you all. Yes, it. See you tomorrow. All right. Good night. Love y'all. Love y'all. Be good blessed. Night. Sleep tight. Don't let the beer bugs bite. We love you guys. Sleep tight. Thank you for coming. Thank you for the thumbs up. Thank you for everything. Love y'all. Hugs and kisses. Hugs, hugs and kisses. <laughs> <laughs>